can't see anything. Yeah. I got you. Oh. Right. Hello. <laughs> Is it me you're looking for? Um, welcome to the Dr. Green Thumb podcast on YouTube and um, Twitch. It's Monday, so excuse us if we're starting a little slow. Um, we got my man, Mr. Fast Hands, the icon, Eric Bobo. What's up good? Chair. Team icon. The iconic one. And back from vacaciones, my man, C minus, Mr. Goodlight, back in effect. Yeah. Oh, yes. Uh-huh. Hey, hey. Well, it's good to be back. It's great to be back. I think you need to put bring this one up just a little bit more and put a little bass on it because it seems tin, man. What up? <laughs> um, oh, yeah. Not you. I didn't mean you, see my son, man. I was like, I'll try, bro, but I don't know. <laughs> I meant the instant replay. It's the mic, bro. Sorry. I'll start. All right. <laughs> Sorry. We got Colton Kill. You need to put a little bit more bass on it. Oh, I'll get Put some bass in there, man. You need to put some bass. Colton Kill, Roy, and Ra Ra back there. Hello. What up? What up? I meant in that replay. This one. <laughs> I got you. See? Do that? There we go. Hello. Yeah. And back from the dentist. Hell my yeah. Eho, who cost me a lot of money. He's on de la mort. Apparently he didn't pay for the dental bill. No, no, no. Yeah, I'm working it off. <laughs> uh, but not yeah, yeah, it I, off, I, buddy. He put, <laughs> he put it on layaway, man. You can't you put teeth I mean? on layaway, bro. But yeah, I am back. <laughs> oh, you can. I got. Um, he is I can, back. I can talk today. I was here last time, but you know, I, it feels good to be eating again. Regular solids, food, solids and shit. Yeah. Hell yeah. It's the meds were not solids. that great, but you know, they still got me through it. Got to take care of your teeth, <laughs> man. Did you, um, I'll tell you one thing. I want to bring up because. I have not taken a tolerance break since I was 18. One second. Right, no, go ahead. Go ahead. Yeah. You'll forget. Go ahead. So I haven't taken a tolerance break since I was 18, and that was like the first time I actually stopped smoking, right? Mm-hmm. Oh, my God. The fucking nightmares. Oh, yeah? They were, like, they came in fucking, ha- they came in hot, bro. Like, and I know that, just to describe it, the, 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 the whole dream, I was in some kind of highway. My friend who's no longer here was driving. And out of fucking nowhere, you know what a shroom looks like? Just like a little cap? Mm-hmm. Yeah. There was like three or four of them, but they were like ships, like UFO ships, and they looked like they were made out of wood. Oh, hell yeah. They came out and like like to the freeway, and people were like, hold on. They all getting out of their car, right? And then I'm like, yeah, let's start filming this. And then the shit fucking blast off. And then the next thing I remember is a fucking earthquake, right? A vivid earthquake. And I'm just like tripping out. And I wake up still tripping, thinking I'm in the earthquake. So I get up and I want to grab my girl. Like, come on, let's fucking go. <laughs> like, I'm really fucking tripping. <laughs> and wow. I fucking had to calm the fuck down. Like, I really had to calm the fuck down. And I, it took me a while, a while to settle down and realize, dude, this, this shit. I don't dream regularly, but this shit, this nightmare from not smoking came came in heavy, dude. Because it's probably been a long time wow. since you did nothing. It, the UFO mm. shit was kind of scary because I'm like, please don't let me get abducted in this dream. Word. <laughs> um, wow. I want to let y'all know before we, you know, go any further. We got my man, Tony Touch, legendary, in the building. He's coming through. Tony Toca? Yes. Tony I think he's already here. We got to just bring him on up. Um, but yeah, my man, Toca. You know what I'm saying? That's family right there. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? Oh, gee. We, we had some good times. We had some good times with Toka. And I tell you what, a lot of people might not know this, um, but he served as DJ for Cypress Hill for, for some shows yeah, on many occasions. This is true. You know, the legendary one. Oh, there, there he's, it is. He's, he's in the building, yo. He's in the building. He's in the motherfucking Tony building. Tony Toka. My brothers. I've been waiting yeah. a long time over here What's up, man? You to get Tony? you on this show, Poppy. Yes, sir. I finally made it, yo. You know? Hey, you know, I'll tell you a funny story, right? I go down to NYC. Well, hey, let's that, let's that get Tony camera. on camera. There, there, there goes your camera. And headphones are optional. We got them right there if you want to hear all the shit. Any headphones? Are they there for are they there? Yeah, there you go. Bang. Yeah, there you That's go. Right. Bang. Um, so, you know, he, welcome, Tony, to the show. Oh, welcome, man. Legendary. My brother is so man. happy to be here, man. Oh, yeah. OG. Yes, yeah, sir. Sure. Yes. Um, one time I was out there. I was going to specifically, I think, to DJ at, at uh, 
Tony's spot at the time where he was streaming his show for Be Real TV. Um, and uh, yeah, that's you. Hey, we had you. Well, we had right. you ready, Papa. Uh, yeah. You working out, Doc? Uh, you know, I get it in uh, when I can. I, I, it looks like you've been working out. A little bit, right? A little bit. A little bit. Um, so <laughs> we go do we go do his radio show first. We go do that. Yeah. And then uh, you know we 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 do all the the necessaries and you know all to to be on radio. Plug the gig, right? Yeah. And we're on the way to the gig, and I got a fucking fat bag of weed in my pocket in a fat one rolled yeah. and we was smoking on the way to the gig bro and it was so fat that the smoke was just pluming out of his suburban it caught the nose of you know some NYPDs and they immediately got on us and pulled us over I and, was, and I was with you you was with us yes yeah, Bubba was. was with us? Bubba yes. was with us, yeah. Okay, then I'm you. telling the story to see minus <laughs> Okay. <laughs> there it is. I'm looking in your direction, but I'm looking at C minus. <laughs> Word. I was, um, I was there. Bobo was like, I Bobo was there. Bobo was there, that's I was, right. I was there. It, was, it, was, it was Toka, yeah. Bobo, Sony, and myself. That's right. And we were chief and heavy. And <laughs> Damn. <laughs> hey, bro. He was asking Tony whose truck this was, all this other shit. <clears throat> and then he finally pulls me got. Pull, they pull me out. And they, oh, hey, yo, it's um, you, you're you're that you're that Cypress Hill guy, right? Hey, Cypress. Yeah, some shit like this, yo, right? Cypress. Almost. Let me see if I could uh see if you could conjure it up, straighten it up a little. Yeah. So we got pulled over. Uh, you know they they uh they immediately smelled the weed and yeah. asked me if I had uh if I was smoking. I said I wasn't. <laughs> and then you step and said I was smoking, officer. You know. Yeah, that's right. I'm from uh, I'm from Cali, and I've got a med card, and uh, I know that doesn't probably fly here, but I'm the one with the weed, and I'm the one smoking, and blah, blah. So they get us out the car. They'd be like, all right, you guys got any weapons? She's like, nah. I said, all right, we, you know, we're going to check the car to see if there's any weapons here. So they made us all sit in the back. Yeah, that's right. That's right. They separated y'all? No, nah, they, kept, they kept us together. No. They let us sit in the back. Now, what happened was while we were sitting in the back and they're checking the car out, another cop car pulls up. That's right. It was the second set. The second set. And they looked right at you and Bobo and it's like, hey, where's Muggs? That's right. <laughs> they, didn't, they didn't say nothing. <laughs> they didn't Muggs. say no, yo, you, uh, you know, is this, you be real? No, they just, all they looked, did was look at you and go, hey, where's Muggs? <laughs> And that was it. And he's like, oh, he didn't make this trip. Because okay. those were the ones that had to run in with exactly. Muggs and Send Dog exactly. the year before. <laughs> exactly. Exactly. And then the cop comes back to the back of the vehicle, gives you back your joint, says you guys are free to go. Yeah. yeah. It was it. hilarious. And you know... Did let thing, you smoke it? No, he didn't let us smoke it. He just gave it back to us and let us go. But what, what <clears throat> no one realized is it was cold that night. And Sony didn't have a jacket or anything. I don't think you did either. I yeah. brought one. I'm from Cali. It's cold to me. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. <laughs> and I had my ounce bag in it. And Sony was cold. In the, in, I don't know where she was. She was sitting in the back with Bobo, right? Mm -hmm. Yeah. yeah. And, and I said, you could wear my shit. And my ounce was in that fucking pocket. I didn't totally oh. fucking spaced out <laughs> that it was there until we got to the club. And she gave it back to me, yeah. and I fucking put my hand in my pocket <coughs> Shit. to put my phone in it. And, oh, they, and they hadn't stuff. even found that. They, they did. Yes, they didn't even look. Damn. Right. If they had, like, searched us outside of the car, they'd find that back. Yeah, that would have been something else. But it's funny because you had that big softball bat you showed them. It's like, well, yeah, we're smoking, and I'm, this is mine or whatever. <laughs> a bat? It was like it was a it, bit. It was oh, okay, significant. I thought you meant like smoking out of a bat. No, 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 no. Yeah, it looked like a bat. You it was like maybe... Uh, Six of six of these, yeah. like <laughs> yeah, it was heavy duty. It, it was, was heavy duty. It was and heavy then, duty. And then the cops say uh, they said that uh, they pulled us over, and we were like three blocks away, three and blocks. they smelled it, and they were like, "Where's that?" They were parked on 14th Street and shit, Second <laughs> Avenue. They fucking we made the it smell. right on Second by like 10th Street. They're like they're smelling it still. <laughs> That's crazy. They fucking tracked us down, boy. That fire. Yeah, yeah, that gas. That gas he lit up. Hey, yeah. but salute to them because they let us go. And normally, you know, they ain't letting you go for that. Yeah. And they're not just going to search the weapons or for, for weapons in the car. They're going to search you, too. I've had I've had a fair share of luck <clears throat> with that, with run-ins like that and having weed on me, man. I can't front. Weed is like a four-leaf clover. 
Thanks, yeah. Thanks. It's good luck. I've I gotten. think it's also you didn't really approach it in a hostile manner. No, the and I was, you know, like the all the thing that I always do is be up fucking front. Yeah, if you have like blatantly, yeah, bluntly and blatantly up front with the shit. If you had it, to keep yeah. it be one thousand, like one thousand, that was really it. a big factor. Why well, I didn't well, fuck you see, with you like that? It all that also takes off. You know, it takes a uh, takes the edge off the, and the edge off and takes off their focus of like they're they're coming at you like one way like. They're going to ask you all these questions everything. B just came out and said, yo, it's my weed. Boom, boom, yeah. I got a card and everything. So you're giving them all this stuff, and then they have to reset. I'm yeah. being you know 1,000 I mean? with them. I'm not giving them any reason to have to look for it. I'm not telling them, nah, yeah. I ain't got it. And then they find it, and then that's exactly. when they fuck with you. I'm like being like 1,000 with them yeah. off top. That was key. And yeah. that's always key. I tell you, we... We got caught out there many times like that, but it's it's because we were just like open about it and not yeah. like trying to hide it after the fact. Right. Like, yeah, you know what? I remember we got we we were rolling through Central Park mm. in um in the van. We were doing promo shit with Sony reps and all this, and we had a driver who who decided he was gonna cut through the park. He knew all the fucking you know the police that work the fucking park and all that shit. Sure mm -hmm. enough, we get pulled over and we're in mid smoke. We got one burning. It's mm -hmm. hotbox. Remember that shit? Yeah. It was Mike driving our you know, yeah. we got this driver named Mike who's based out of the East Coast. Mm -hmm. And we were boxing the van that, or the the suburban or whatever yeah. we were in. Yeah. I can't we remember. Were, we were chiefing out. <laughs> we were chiefing out. And the Sony rep sees the cops coming up and she is tripping. <laughs> oh my God, oh my God. What a what are we going to do? I mean, it, I'm like, just relax. And then Mike starts talking to him. He starts dropping names. They look in the car. He starts dropping names of cops he knows mm. that are like, that run shit in their precinct or whatever. And uh, then they look in the van. And look, <laughs> These fucking guys. All right, yeah, go ahead. Yeah. Have a good fucking day. We've got a little it, lucky, it, it, man. We've got lucky we've got in got places lucky. that we should not be getting so lucky in but i gotta give it to them you know hey yeah i mean hey, it wouldn't be the first time people say new york uh, cops play ball you know sometimes yeah i mean th i mean there's a we lot didn't of have to bribe them though they yeah, just let us there's go. a lot more worse i mean yo the whole fucking the, the east coast has that history of that organization so it's just like a really least of the worries of a cop it like, is hey, man it is somebody fucking held up a truck and jacked all this shit that was coming to a store and they're not gonna you know they're gonna bring in cypress hill uh, <laughs> like, oh mean, they've if they brought in they brought in half of Cypress Hill into their station. They had records. Wow. Me yeah. and Bobo haven't been in there. I'm not trying to go. <laughs> we ain't trying to go there. <laughs> I've, I've had, had enough. enough. But yeah. no Dog and fucking Muggs have definitely been <laughs> in there. Yeah. And that was illustrated by, hey, where's Muggs? That's funny. Wow. That was off the top. Yeah. That was where's funny, Muggs? Yeah, right off the top. Hey, I, tell, I, to, I, I told Muggs that story the other day. He oh, just yeah. he cracked a smile because he knows what, what it was. Dude. That's funny as shit. <laughs> hey, we were doing, a, again, an, a promo run. I think it was even maybe on that same run. We were doing a promo run, and um, mm. me and Bobo were going to meet Muggs in New York and Canada because they were doing something in New York, and we had to do something else, but we were meeting them there and and then going into canada and then we get the call hey these motherfuckers went to jail last night they're not gonna make it oh shit and i think bobo and i still had to roll yeah and and take care of the interview shit that we were doing on that promo run but yeah they they got locked up Damn, so man. half of cypress hill been locked up in new york Wow. The other half, not so much. No. No, no. We're trying to keep that. I told you. This half no, right no. here, we've been locked up in L.A. L.A. We got West we, Coast. We've been. Yeah. We, we had the, <laughs> West we've Coast. Been locked, we got that West Coast lock up. They got the East Coast lock up. Yeah. We're whole locked up, dog. We just, <laughs> yeah, man. We don't want to be in the middle. Exactly. No, no. Now the middle is some Ooh, other shit. The mid, the mid, you know, no, no, middle, no, no. middle America. <laughs> no, no, nah, nah. I know. They don't care who the fuck you are. No, they don't. No. They, they they see what you got and then they add to it. Yeah. That's true. And then you're fucked. Yeah. Yeah. Totally fucked. But I told them. New York has come a little bit of a way now because what I read this morning is that they're no longer gonna be seizing weed at airports. That's right. That's fucking awesome. That means now you can travel to and from New York 
with with some your weed. medicine. Oh man, that's something. Hey, ain't that glorious, man? That's glorious. I could take. You knew. Some- did hey, you know this? You know what? Guy? You know this? Yeah, yeah. I mean, that's never been an issue for me anyway. Right, right, right. Right. <laughs> and right. Well, I'm glad uh, you know they gave everybody else the green light. I'm glad y'all are here. Yeah. <laughs> I'm Man, glad they, you know, oh, it's yeah. it's cool for me because now, like, when I take shit down there, I don't gotta worry. Okay, I gotta put it on my check in, and if I don't, if, like, if it's a quick one, yeah. right? Like, it's maybe a, a two night or an overnight thing. I don't know, I always want to bring a fucking big ass bag. I'll bring like an overnight Jeez. or something, right? Right. But like bringing weed back from there, you gotta fucking check it in, or you gotta leave it because realistically. Unless, you know, you got the balls yeah. the size of grapefruits, you don't take shit through, yeah. you know, you don't you don't take weed from New York nah. to Cali. You just don't do that. Mm-hmm. Unless you got weed from Cali that you're bringing with you. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, but it's it. risky. Yeah. Because if you do put it in your check-in, those motherfuckers down there at the bags that randomly screen it, that's like a jackpot for them. They are going to take it. Nah. Right? Oh, man. Not now. Because now you could fucking complain and say, hey, man, what happened to my fucking jaws, son? <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> I had yeah, four. Right. I had four in there. That's right. Yeah, you can dispute that. Yeah, you could dispute that. But sh- if they're letting you travel with it, backpack or your carry-on, man. Carry Fuck on, dude. that. Yeah. Whatever the limit is, you take that. Hell sure. yes. Yep. Take that. We sure did. Word. Hey, we've you- come a long way, man. New York with that shit. The whole, you know. Everybody's about to jump in the pit and, and, you know, get these businesses rolling, you know? Yeah. The, yeah. You, can walk, the, the, you can walk around and smoke now? Is that yeah, what they're saying? pretty much. And it's like, Matt, we like, used to do that shit in the 90s, ooh. and it was totally against the law, For but sure. now it's like, pff, gonna there's be the thing. There's a lot of videos out there of people just like, fucking just, hey, it is like, it doesn't matter. Watch this, B. Yeah. I've been seeing it on World Star. <laughs> what is it? Yeah, bro. I've been seeing it on World Star New York. There's shit yeah. no World Star Latino. And it's like, you know, it's ran by some Puerto Rican dudes. So it's yeah. like, you know, for sure. It's like they're showing all that. He's like, no pasa nada. You know, just no, because, you know, uh, I mean, for many, many years, I mean, yeah, you, no, I mean, you could no be, you was, everybody was smoking outside, but you was keeping that eye out, yeah. you know, for 5 0. Yeah, oh, but not hey, giving you know a fuck style, a, though. A, you know what I mean? Can, yeah. Right. You know what's going to kill it in New York, though? The delivery service, because they're the ones that fucking had that before anybody. Had that on lock. That motherfuckers on ten speeds, fucking delivering like gas That's of right. sour diesel. That's right. Um, mm. there was other strains that 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 were there that were nice, but if you didn't have that hookup, boo. I mean, that was the dispensary because they came with flavors. It came with flavors. You know, they would come with yeah. like flavor. Here you go. Those little D's. Those, those little rectangular fucking plastic fucking joints. Mm, yeah. Exactly. Square tubes. Exactly. Yeah. Exactly. So you would get like the little mini dispensary. Oh yeah. You know there. You know. So now I mean they're gonna up on really it. can kill it. Rolling oh, up on yeah, a ten speed. It looks like you can carry up quite a bit too. You can uh, possess up to three ounces what? and twenty four grams of concentrate. Fuck out of <laughs> here! Oh y'all are doing it. Oh man, that's <laughs> awesome. I mean, it, it, when whenever you see another state go through this phase. I mean, come on, man. That shit, you, we knew how great that shit was. Yeah, but look, check this. But, like, this. you get to see them, and it's like, hey, man, to them, it's a, just, just like a really big deal. It but is, eventually, yeah. they change it up, because when but, going to Colorado, they're changing the laws. But think about it like this, right? Here mm. in Cali, legal as it is, right, let's say you're not a rec user or, a you know, like a, a medical user, as they say. Mm. You have the doctor's recommendation, whatever. Right. If you're just a, a, a recreational user, it's a, a fucking ounce, Mm. And I don't know how much concentrates. I forget that what it, that's what it is, but it's an ounce. If you're a medical card holder, whatever, or a rec holder, it's eight ounces. Mm. Mm. In New York, just for a recreational user, three fucking ounces. That's awesome. Are you kidding me? Oh. I told them. In California, it's uh, eight grams of concentrates a recreational user can hold up to. Three fucking ounces. Three ounces and 24 grams of concentrate as opposed to one ounce and five grams. What the fuck? Wow. Man, like, think shit. about that. How fucked is that? For Like, we're, we're being punished out here. It's not cool. We yep. are being punished. But, see, that, that's the point that I was trying to make earlier, that those... Right now, people in the Colorado, they got the freedom to carry around a fuckload of hash rosin. And they're like, yeah, man, we got to enjoy this now because in like four months, that shit's going to go to like, hey, you only can carry like eight grams or some shit like that. 
You know, we had it pretty good. But it's just dope to see all these other states go through it because right now it's that phase, that wild, wild west phase. Yeah, yeah. They yeah. have to see how it goes, you know. But uh, you're right. I mean, it's just good to just see it happening regardless because, oh, yeah. fuck, man, the struggle. Oh. You know, back Ooh. in the day, like, okay, man, do you have a hookup over there? Yeah. Oh, they're going to be chiefing at your parties, you know? Tom. Yeah, dude. Mm-hmm. They're going to be chiefing more, heavy more at your parties, so. son. Yeah. Absolutely. Yeah, <laughs> yeah. Absolutely. Yeah, now I'm looking forward to it. Uh, you know, especially more like in the fall, going into the fall, the winter is when mm. it's going to probably it's it'll be in the nice. right place. Right now, everybody just wants to be outside. Yeah. Yeah. You know? Everybody's so been everybody, cooped up. Everybody's, you know, yeah. chiefing outside. Chiefing or, outside, enjoying. No need to be indoors yet like that, you know? Yeah, because when winter comes, you'll have a whole lot of time to be inside. That's right. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, <laughs> Shit. that's right, man. But uh, good time's coming. Word. Hey, you you put out a another another uh, album recently, right? Uh, it was like a single. It was a like single, a maxi right? single. It's got a bunch of remixes on it. Um, yeah, I, we did it with um on Vega Records. The name of the record is called Sakule. Yeah, and uh, you know it's more of a, ha- a house, you know, Afro, Afro Latin, Latin kind of Brazilian vibe to it. You know, yeah. If you heard of that, having fun with that that that, that, that shit they was, they're doing in, in Cuba. Um, it's it's a style called bac- Bacoso. Mm. Mm-hmm. That, I hear that shit is crazy. And, and speaking of Cuba, y'all got to get with game, mm. and uh, you know, figure out how you can support, cause uh, you know they want change. It's getting fucked up. Yeah. Yeah, man. It's getting real fucked up. It's fucked up in many places, not just there. That's one yeah. of many places in the world mm. that is absolutely fucked up right now. Yeah, and that mm-hmm. needs change. So. You know, get up on game, but Bacoso, mm. it's 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 Afro Latin rhythm, mm-hmm. but like you know today's style shit. I don't know, like th- there was a documentary on it. It's pretty dope. Yeah, yeah. I mean, this, that's the one. Bacoso, <clears throat> Bacoso. With a P or with a B? B. Okay. Bacoso. I think that's my man Heway was the DJ Heway was featured in that, if I'm not mistaken. Mm. I my think brother, so. He went from Cuba. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. I, I got through to him the other day. It was him said, and a dude from Miami. Yeah. The dude from Miami went out there with Homeboy or okay. something like that. Mm. Yeah. I saw you so, got a, you had Masters at Work do a remix for you, right? Yeah, yeah. So, um, That's sick. So dude. the record Sakud, and then I did the original version, and then the remixes are like Louis Vega. Yeah. Um, Oscar G from yes. Miami. You know, and this kid Manu, um, f- he lives out in France, but you know, he's got that whole African, that South African sound uh, that he's killing it right now. So, yeah, some interesting mixes on there, and I'm spitting a few little bars, you know. Oh, bing, you, always, you always get them bars in, son. Yeah, I know that. A few little bars, snuck them in there. Yes, yeah. Sir. Uh-huh. Mm-hmm. You know, but um, it's a feel good record, you know, just talking about, you know, Saku, that means like shake it off, you know. Yeah. That dirt off your shoulders and, you know, let's keep it moving. Let's keep clean moving, up yeah. and, yeah, you know. Dope. That's yeah. that's the way of life, man. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. You fall off the horse, you get up, dust yourself off, jump back on and keep riding. That's Unless it. Christopher Reeves you. Unless, yes. Ooh. With the horse. Facts. <laughs> wow. Yikes. Well, horses uh, are dangerous, bro. <laughs> well, yeah. <laughs> well. Why would you not think that they were? I mean, yeah, you got to just be nice to them, man. Mm. Nice. Be nice, bro. Just Horses nice. are smart. When they don't want a motherfucker on them, they'll f- they'll know, let you know. They'll let you know. Oh, they gonna let you know. Yeah. First, they ain't gonna make it easy for you to get on, and then Ooh. once you're on, they're Look gonna be like shit. this. Look at that, uh, Look at that shit. Damn. She's like, get off me. Get off me. Damn. Horse like See now that could have been really <laughs> ugly because the horse could have like <laughs> fell on half of him. <laughs> you know what I mean? Look at that. Backdrop that girl, man. Gave her Get off me, bitch! That's fucked up. That was fucked hilarious. up. Fuck now. Fucking stem cell slam. So, yo, so so Toka, man, I, and with during the pandemic, you was really getting off on like the Twitch shit. How 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 did you like doing that? I know you're still doing it, but yeah. how was that transition for you, like? You know, how was that? To go from like, what do you mean, from like Instagram to Twitch? Yeah, 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 and all of that stuff. Yeah. Um, I mean, you know, the way had already started, so, you know, more so on the West Coast, I think. And, um, you know, I heard about it for a minute, 
And, um, you know, things just started getting more, you know, there were more restrictions on the music you could play on Instagram. So a lot yeah. of DJs were getting cut off. Cut and, off. You know, Shit is ridiculous. And then you couldn't share it or whatever. <laughs> so it drove more traffic to Twitch. It just made the most sense, you know. Um, yeah, they only give okays to, to who, whoever they choose to. The IG. At IG. You know what yeah. I'm saying? Because realistically... Yeah, everybody, everybody gets fucked with for their mixes there. Yeah, I mean, for a while, you know, the, shit, the sessions were flying, and you know, I was having a great run, you know, with them. And I still, you know, we still stream on the gram, but you know, Twitch is where the uh, music heads is at. You know, that's they're looking for it. So you know, that's exactly. a great audience to cater to people that are like. They want to see what's up, or they follow you and when stuff. You, so. When you come back, you got to drop a mix for us. Oh, yeah, man. You know Let's go. Son? I'm with that. Got to do that. Hell, yeah. I'm with gotta that, Got to get man. one of them authentics going on over yeah, here. You know? Man, let me jam with you. Yo, let's go, man. Oh, he's got the setup here. Yeah. I, see, I see you with the, the, the bongos and shit like that. Uh, and you're uh, like, oh, shit. That's right, man. You should I get lit, you. bro. Like, your, your, your show is probably one of the smokiest shows that I heard. It was Toca Tuesdays. Oh, the Toca on, Tuesdays. Yeah, I remember listening Tuesdays. to that when I was in college, man. I would, I would be waiting for my next class, and I'd be smoking in my car. Yeah. Well, I had, like, an hour gap. And I just yeah. remember just, like... The talk I Tuesday talk and just oh, over yeah. and over Lit. again. I was like, yeah, you made sure fools remember Lit. that. <laughs> yeah. Oh, man. Wow, man. Oh, so I, that's probably the X, the serious XM show. Yeah, I had an XM of a car. They yeah. they got me on that. All I needed was like three months, and I was like, oh, this is lit. I'm buying this for sure. Awesome, yeah, man. Well, if you want play, quality, because he shit, plays that real shit. Yeah. yeah. And like, he was talking about weed yeah. and shit oh, and, like, yeah. openly, like, what you smoking? Uh, and yeah, people will call sessions, in. Yeah. Every other show, every, every other show, people will be like, what you drinking on? Because they're afraid to go there because yeah. they're thinking it's, yeah. it's going to do something to your career. I'm like, well, what about now? Now, man. You know what I mean? You're ahead of your right, time. Right. Yeah, that's yeah. funny that. Yeah, we were repping that early. The smoke out mix. Yeah. Yeah. Smoke out yeah. mix. Smoke yeah. out yep. mix. Call up. Yeah. Tell us what you smoking on. Yep. Yeah, man. Early on, man. Somebody had to do it. Somebody had to fucking... You know, open up the door to do yeah. that shit. Even on the radio, you know, on, musically, on, whatever. On Sirius XM, because yeah. it's like it's like Ezone said, a lot of motherfuckers was drink orientated on their shows. Mm -hmm. Tony's was like the first one talking about we getting our fucking puff on what you smoking. And on. now it's yeah. ahead of your it's ahead of your time and when that, you look at it. Yeah, for yeah, sure. Yeah. And now it's it settles in like because it, yeah, you know, everybody's doing the same thing. They're, they're listening to what you're putting down, smoking out with you. Fuck yeah. You know, as 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 the whole shit is supposed to be in the first place. Exactly. Hell yeah, man. Medicine and music, baby. It's always together. That works. Works. Absolutely. Hey, you had like the original, we had the original Zoom room format back in the day. When yeah. We were streaming. Oh, yeah. What was the On name the original, of that program? The Stick Camp. Stick, stick Camp. Camp. Yeah. Yeah. That, you know, we try to tell some of these folks the original know, zoomers yeah yeah come from this this yeah. side right yes, here the, yeah. the, 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 the tech, who are online the, no 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 the technology the of, of what zoom does yeah. right in their meeting format mm -hmm. shit with their cams like the way that it's centered that is what stick cam was exactly. as a streaming network like you stream didn't do anything like that it was the camera here and maybe one other camera right you know like to to switch the look from with with stick cam, which is where B Real TV started, right. it was the center cam, which you see now. And then let's just say along the side, four windows here for fans, and four windows here right. for fans. So we could pick whatever uh, group of fans that we wanted to be in those cams. And sometimes you'd see motherfuckers in their grow room, chicks on a on a stripper's pole. Yeah. Um, of other motherfuckers doing other things that they should, you know. <laughs> yeah, it was snorting up lines. Snorting up lines. <laughs> other motherfuckers counting money, and some Hell people yeah. just watching the show, and some people being ridiculous. Now they, some now, people. Oh, yeah. now you got to go on Discord to see all that crazy shit. People will be in there, be like, "Hey, let's do this bump thread." I'm like, "Dude, bump hey, thread." You know, <laughs> hey, <laughs> hey, no, no, no. <laughs> hey, check this thread? out. The, the closest, the closest to what Stick Cam is doing right now, is this this shit called Bego Live. Like when you go on there, it's it's meant for the phone. I don't know if they if 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 you could rock with a laptop or a desktop on it, but mm. 
it's the closest format to what stick M used to look like. Mm. But with all these crazy other weird ass features and shit like that, we've never streamed on it because we can't do what we do on it. Like it's, you know, if, if we tried to smoke on it, they would ban our account that day. Wow. So, you know, that's why I don't fucks with it. Oh, I okay. I sticks with this over here. But who kid fucks with it? DJ who kid does, does his thing on there. I was on his shit and it was just popping off and wow. it reminded me of what stick cam was it seems mm -hmm. like maybe they bought the technology and just implemented different rules those, something yeah. i don't those know those are some good wow. days though stick, stick, cam, stick cam was oh, the shit man. those it companies shit. get bought out like that man like if it happens well, to food companies or certain things well, they got that, some good popping they're like hey that company didn't get bought out or like some like what is it the technology gets taken it didn't get taken he he owned the guy who owned that technology took it all with him he was like they couldn't figure out how to monetize the streaming because they didn't have S FFC type of shit, right? I mean, FCC type of shit where, you know, guidelines, rules, restrictions, and they had no one to administer any of that. So, like, if a, a company like Levi's comes on and says, I'm going to give you $100,000 for this time for these streams blah 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 whatever however that deal is right mm. um all these sponsors with the big money as they looked into it they said well you know you got no control of your fan base here so like if one of your streamers has someone in the cam who decides to pull their dick out on the cam you guys can't get that fast so enough that's <laughs> Right? Yeah. Or if someone does drugs on the camera, like fucking pulling out a mirror and fucking doing a bump right there. <laughs> bump thread? They, they, you know, they didn't have Jeez. a way to deal with that. Instagram and, still and, lets and, fools do and, that. And corporate motherfuckers would not put their money into that because if someone happens to seize that, see that that shouldn't, like a watchdog group or something, mm -hmm. they're on their back. Oh, you're fucking funding this company that allows this drug use and this and that and the other and wow. they don't want none of that smoke none. so they were never able to acquire like real sponsorship from from any any companies they had the technology they had the user base they had like fucking 10 million users 10 maybe over that mm. i think it was well over that they just could not get anyone to invest in the sponsorship of it because it was loose cannon shit. Loose cannon. Yeah. Loose cannon shit Damn. all over the place. I mean, people would be having sex in those fucking camps. Like that's that's what how they fucking came up with the technology. It was a porn <laughs> it was a fucking porn company coming up with this technology <laughs> to watch, you know, all these Other fuck camps. Fuck. Wow. Right? And you Dirty. know, he figured out, okay, I'm going to flip it into this uh, streaming service like this Ustream shit or something, right? And People were used to fucking, you know, on there. So oh, Yeah, they yeah. weren't going to pay for watching people like us talk the shit we talk. They wanted to see the fuck. Right. Dirty yeah. chatterbait. Right. And, that, and, and that, <laughs> that site could not give them that, not right. legally. Wow. They could not do it. Mm. And, yet, and, and, and they could not stop people from fucking showing up in a camera before the admin... Like, th they may have been fucking in that cam for 60 seconds before the admin was able to get get to it and fucking get them out and kick them out, ban them or block them or whatever the fuck. Like, so yeah. shit like that that slides through. Like, on, on TV, you don't see that shit. Mm. Right? Mm -hmm. So Because they're, they got these guidelines and these rules, and so they'll, they know that their brand ain't going to be attached to something that goes awry and that could be bad bad uh, press yeah. for the brand. So, you know, yeah, yeah they didn't want to invest. But okay. isn't something like Snapchat, didn't that start out, like, more on the porno-ish tip? Well, know? Snapchat? Yeah. And or, now it was, it was just something, like, because before it would just delete everything, so it would be very discreet. It was kind of like the approach of a <laughs> uh, little, like, what whatever what's, WhatsApp is looked at. You know what Were I mean? Were you talking about Stickam or Snapchat? No, Snapchat. Snapchat. Oh. Okay. It was very like, oh, there's no re there's no recollection of it. You know what I mean? That so yeah. it was it was meant to be like I send you a message and we forget about it. Right. Like, for what so for whatever reason you wanted to use that kind of shit, it was there. Right. Word. Yeah. Yeah, good old stick M man. That shit was yeah, awesome. Man. We did it live from the club and everything. Oh man. Oh. Hey, the oh, numbers yeah. were crazy too. I mean 
Sometimes crazy. the numbers were just ridiculous. Crazy, crazy. Yeah. The, like Six the people, digits. the people that are just now hitting those type of numbers here on YouTube because I've seen shows like hit those kind of numbers. Mm. I tell you what, we were doing that with Stick M way like before we started it here, like 10 years ago, 12 years ago, some shit like that. Right. Um, man. Mm. The, Crazy the, numbers, the, man. Yes. We would end up, I remember there was on days we'd end up with probably like 60 to 70,000 live views in one sitting. And then whatever the archive would build up would be. And then I remember we, we streamed something that got like 250,000 live views wow. in one sitting. In a two in a three hour sitting, that shit yeah. was crazy. Man, I remember that the the first like I mean you do like DJ shit, but the first like live like musician shit was me and Red Medic, uh, Cypress Junkies over in the downtown studio. Oh yeah, we did it over there oh. and when we moved up to downtown the first time. Mm. Boy, Kenny's old spot. Yeah, in the loft. Word. What's crazy is that we can give them shit like that right here in this building. But they got to earn it. You know what I mean? Yeah, yeah do it. Sir. Let them know. You, know let them know. Let you them already know. know our challenge. You know, every Damn. show, 2,000 likes. Maybe we ought to put this in the caption, Colton, at 2,000 likes mm -hmm. while we're live. Opens up a performance. Mm. You know what I'm saying? I, because maybe we're not adding that in the caption. That Maybe that's something something i don't know but oh, yeah you guys been killing those live sets like oh thank the hole you, in the head oh, oh thank you guys you. did that one the other day that yeah. just, yo, you know you i meant to do killing that shit i meant <laughs> to do more of the song that was a dope one right but there. one they didn't learn it and two it stopped where it stopped like yeah. like you know it i think that was a part of a medley uh, that goes into something else because it cut right at that moment like i didn't mute it to be fucking <laughs> oh, said, you didn't I, stop it? I didn't stop it, like, to be, like, trying to do a fucking drop and then a comeback in or whatever. The fucking song stopped. Right? Oh, you need the you need the other version. I need the full version, bop, bop. But, yeah. they, you know, they didn't <laughs> oh, they didn't earn the full version yeah. anyway. You I know what I mean? Right. That. I was just saying by Mike, I would I, most likely, because I love y'all, I would have just kept going right. and did the whole song. No, I'm saying just yeah. on GP, but it stopped. Ooh, so that's a banger. Yeah, I love that that's one, one of my yeah, favorites. Yeah. Classic. Oh yeah, that's a, that's it's a, a nice banger. little story. And Muggs did his thing on that beat. Yeah, yeah. It's it's there's just a swing to it. That was one of the first songs that I heard of Cypress. Hold ahead, uh, funky feel one, and uh, Stone is the way to walk. Mm. I'm like then these Ooh. motherfuckers right now. It's crazy because I was just going to pick up some weed first here in Cyprus. Like I guess, you know, <laughs> I was going to just pick up some weed and some, you know, Asian course. guy was, you know, who was the guy. He was playing Cypress Hill. Sick. And he just played them three songs over and over and over on, on cassette. Damn. I'm like, Damn. Oh, yeah. How funny was that? We were fucking singing that song like it was like a lullaby. <laughs> <laughs> man, that shit. I mean, it's ill, man. It, it was ill. Very so. Hey, Tony played some sets with us. Yeah, oh, man. Yeah. Oh, yeah. We, wow. we we did some things. Yeah, man. World, yeah, you know? We went, went to Brazil. Yeah. I think, was it? Yeah. yeah. Hell yeah. Wow. Uh, yeah, we traveled. Yeah. Did some East Coast uh, East Coast runs. We yeah, did man. some East Coast runs, yeah. That was awesome. Yeah, a lot of people don't know the, the, the Familia Connection. You yeah, know, man, with, with that was Tonka an honor, here. man, honor to be a, be a part of that, man, ensemble, you yeah. know? Yeah, no, no, that was good times man, right was there, was a vibe man. right there, yo. Hell yeah. I still remember the joint we did, the intro, right, with like a Descalga song. That's right. Yeah. We did something. I played that like not long ago on the show, and, you know, yeah, that was a heater. Yeah. No, we, we, we was killing it, man. No, that was the shit. We got catalog, all of us. Fucking man. A. We got some catalog. And, and I think the... On your record, on the Peacemaker Two, is the uh, only uh, on the joint. You know the rules. Uh, oh yeah. Uh, that's the only joint that has all four members of Cypress on that. That's right. I mean, as far as like when you say featuring Cypress Hill, yeah. 
you you got everybody. You, you got Muggs, everybody. Mugs was on that. I mean, that's yeah. why it said it. Yeah, I mean, you know, because sometimes you know they be saying, okay, it's you know featured, you know, group, and right. it's not the whole group. Not to necessarily that you need it yeah, at that right. time, but for this jam, oh man, it, it was perfect. And that outro that you did, psh, you know, a little you bit were slapping that shit, Papa. Come on, Papa. You know, That's what I'm talking about, man. Like, take it back. To, <laughs> take it back to the stoop, Papa. Yo, he was killing you know? it. Yeah, I gotta man. show Tony the stoop back there, yeah, too. Yeah, yeah. he hasn't seen it. He needs to check. Gotta see. He needs to check that. Oh, man. Word up. Um, by the way, this show's brought to you by CBD Lion, uh, king of the motherfucking jungle. You know what I'm saying? Um, you want some CBDs? These are some of the best. If you got them grandparents and parents that are, like, inquisitive but they're not necessarily on that THC level yet, fuck with CBD Lion. All right, they got all sorts of products. They got gummies, edibles, tinctures, topicals, hemp flowers, CBD broad spectrum capsules, isolate products, broad spectrum and full spectrum products, CBD bundles and combo packs, pet tinctures, and treats if you want to treat your pet. You know what I'm saying? Um, mm. You know, they need to be treated right too. All right, so um, CBD Lion got what you need. We fuck with the gummies and the tinctures <clears throat> down here just to let you know they are on the one. Um, mm. Do yourself a favor. Fuck I with CBD them. Lion. I know you told them. I'm telling them again. Uh, you can go to CBDLion.com, use coupon code BEREAL, and get a discount on any product. All right. And uh, for you connoisseurs who like to store your weed properly, Budvac. Go to yes. budvac.com, grab right. yourself one of these jars and uh, pumps. There's manual and electric rechargeable pump, and the jars vary in size, all right? Uh, depending what kind of weed baller you are, you can get any one of these sizes. <laughs> and uh, crack that code at budvac.com, the Be Real coupon code, all right? And uh, you get yourself a discount for any one of these jars and pumps, all right? Budvac.com, they work. We fuck with them. Mm. Promise. That's smart. And we also got uh, new mystery boxes. They drop Friday. It's a two hundred dollar box. Includes shirt, hat, hat, beanie, glass piece, tray, mask, papers, and some other shit. There's total. There's a total of twenty boxes. Know what I'm saying? And uh, there's possibly an action figure in there with a G pen. Vaulted, clear, funky filled tips. Ooh, you might get something, all right? Yep. It's it's mm. cracking off, all right? Mm. They drop Friday. Just letting you know that. And we're here with Tony Touch. Yeah, man. You know what I'm saying? In the building. Tony Touch. Bless, bless, bless. <laughs> yeah, man. That's right. Um, and if you haven't smashed that like yet, what the fuck are you waiting for? Smash it right now. Get Oof. down with this. Unlock that song. I mean, I, I haven't even looked and seen where you guys are at yet, but you know, hey, I'm going to give you the benefit of the doubt and not look at it until after. Smash the likes right now. Mm. And if you are subscribing, click all notifications. If you're not subs subscribing, subscribe right now. Yeah. And uh, get down, leave a comment, all that shit. And we have Mr. Positive here, C-. minus. And Mr. He's Positive bad. here. And most of all, um, more than liking it, you need to share it out. All right, share the show out. Let people know Tony Touch is in the house. Hell yeah. Smoking. Smoking. And just want to let you guys know we got Smoke Train up in the chat. Hell GF. Yeah. GF for sure. GF. Yeah, what up, GF? He says he's going to try making it here sometime this week. Well, all right. Mm -hmm. Dang. That's cool some high-powered cool shit here. What are we smoking anyway? <laughs> uh, that is... Um, <laughs> hey, let, let me see the lighter. You got a lighter over there? <laughs> um, that is uh, Pineapple OZK Oof. from right? Mr. Wonder Brett. Yeah, it, is fire. Yeah. it is fire. Fire. Oh, it yeah. is fire. Fuego. I That's pace right. myself. You could fucking yeah. start a barbecue with this fire. Oof. You know, some 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 uh, strange you need to really pace yourself. Oh yeah. And mm. not go, you know, too overboard. That's right. I'll tell you Friday I was overboard. I was way <laughs> overboard. <laughs> Swear to God, yo. What happened, man? <laughs> Look B, dead ass. What happened? I was fucking totally fucking out of my mind when I went home. I had smashed two of them Wonder Bread gummies. Ooh. And then, you know, we did our show here. I smoked what? Four, 
And then we did the mix show. I smoked another two. Wow. Mostly Wonder Bread shit. And, and, and I can't remember what, what else was in there. But then, what else did we do? We did something else. And, pff, dude, put me over the top. When I went home, I was like, pff, I, I, I was almost tapping out at 9 o'clock. Damn. Oh, I had to yeah. fight. You was I on had, the ropes? I had to fight. I was on the ropes, man. Mm-hmm. I made it to 11. Okay. Normally, normally eleven is nothing. But oh, <laughs> usually, fuck. It, but fuck, how man. Strong, how strong are them gummies? Oh well, yeah. It's not. It's how not. Many, the, and how many did you have? It's their hash rods and uh, it, fuse, bro. It's a big difference. It's actually regular. they're not gummies. They're fruit chews. Fruit chews. Yeah. Fruit chews. Really? Ooh, look at yes. those. Oh, so Wonder this is bread. a different thing going on over here. Well, no, oh man. I mean, I, okay, I got some for you to try. It's solving this. You man. are gonna love these. Yeah. Because they work. I took one before we started the show. <laughs> oh. <laughs> wow. Sharon, bro. R- Rizzle. <laughs> I did. I've only tried to say, Holy baby. Holy shit. Oh, you doing your fruit chew, huh? I'm doing that fruit chew, man. That shit tastes good. Hell There's yeah. no crazy aftertaste. That's what I like about them. Because most of them, you fuck around, oh, yeah. and there is this nasty aftertaste on most of them. Not on Brett shit. It tastes like Brett rubber shit. bands the, with the nasty ones. Right? Yeah. Right? It tastes like, yeah, it tastes, it tastes very fucking like dentist ish. Yeah, it's not nasty. Brett's. <sighs> Brett shit tastes fucking Yeah, no, those, those I got, me I up. got a pack for you. Wow. I got a pack for you too. Uh, how, how, many, oh. how many did you take? Just one? No, I had more than one. Okay. <laughs> I had around about three. I'm, All right. This that's... fuck had almost a bag. I had of two bags two during bags. the time I couldn't smoke. So, but oh, he went. Good. But he went on a roller coaster. And no, and that shit fucked me up because I, when I realized, <laughs> like when I, it was like how I got fucked up in Colorado. You know what I mean? Just the hash is just it, hash yeah. hash infused is something else. And like, mm. I know I'm fucked up when I feel that I can't pick my head up from where I'm at. Facts. Yeah, Colorado was fun. Oh shit! Dead ass, B. Dead ass, B. They're at eight ninety five right now, or is it eight fifty five? I can't fucking tell. <laughs> Where are we at, E Zone? I can't even. I can't read it. I don't have my glasses. We are at eight sixty seven. We're eight sixty seven. There you go, yep. Bobo. Try one. Tell me that shit don't taste Eat good. Eat all of them, Bobo. No, man. We need him. He oh. can't be in a portal. <laughs> Bobo's an extremist. He is an extremist. This is true. He will eat this whole bag. <laughs> yes, he you guys, will. You guys know me so well, right? Yes. I, well, I thought I did till you know, the last year and a half and heard some different stories. According to you, I'm like, damn, that's some new shit. I, yeah. You know, like, that's come with surprises. Yeah. You know? Hold on. Let me see. You. Hey, you know, our friendship's always growing. <laughs> <laughs> I told him. Hey, I must say, the yeah, talk this... to me, talk to me. <laughs> At least Fuck it's it. really good. That's what I'm fucking talking see? about. Mm-hmm. Wow. You should just. You should let Toka try one if you. If, oh yeah, if you yeah, want I'll, one? Sure, I'll give it a shot. Why I'll, not? Sh- I'll share. Why not? Yeah, I'll buy one. Yeah. All right. Yeah, it really does have the pineapple. Yeah, that should taste good, right? No funky ass aftertaste. Mm mm. Are you? Is it cruising by C minus? Mm-hmm. Well, I got another bag for you, Chacho. Don't worry about it. Oh no problem. This is really good. I like this is dangerous. Mm-hmm. I told him. Yeah, this yeah. shit gave me '92 Bobo vibes. Mm. Oh, uh-huh. Yes, hey, bro, those things work fast too. They do. They work fast too. Mm-hmm. I only had one, but I felt it like immediately. Oh, He's like, as a matter of fact, give me one right now. <laughs> mm. 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 Yeah. Those ones especially. No, I had the one with the fucking banana on it. Mm, these Those, pineapple ones, though. The pineapple ones. Man. Nah, you, you got to fucking try the banana, too. It tastes like a legit, like, non-medicated candy. Yes, right? This is like... The danger! Medicine. It's danger. danger. All right. Watch yourself. Pick up some Wonder Bread. Bobo will say he d- he doesn't feel it on purpose right. just to have more. <laughs> I don't, you know what? I don't just feel this. Getting hit. Yeah. He knows he feels it. Uh, <laughs> oh, yeah. What, I got an extra one? Right. Yeah, this the, uh, the you, orange Bobo. banana. That's my favorite. The orange banana. That's mm. the one right there. I got to try that. I told him. I was there. <sighs> yeah. We just did told him. Yeah, no, that shit tastes good. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Have one, Again, anyone who's yeah. done like, <laughs> hey bro, I have another one. Damn, <laughs> hey, bro. see what you did, Brett. 
Now look what you made us do. Oh. <laughs> I'm going to start boxing for the fucking last one. Hell yeah. Get him up, son. You want that last yeah, one? Last we got to go hands. Yeah, they want that. Well, yeah, man. This is the last one. Wow. That's it. Why not? Good thing they're team. eating them now be- than before the podcast. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Because by the time podcast's over, y'all going to be Ooh. nice. All right. Extra. Good, Papa. That's it, Papa. <laughs> I'm, in there. I'm in there with you guys. Let's yeah, go. I know. I'm here for it. Hell yeah. All right, we had our time in Take my word for it. I did have one before we started. I didn't have two like you. How many did you have? Three? <laughs> <laughs> right now, you just three. dropped. You just dropped three right now. Yeah. Bobo doesn't even remember. I think I did four. <laughs> and how many did you drop? <laughs> Two. Two. I gotta catch up. Three. Bring my bag up here, <laughs> Magic Curtain. Can't wow, have is that my, like a thing? I can't have my homies, you know, <laughs> rocking out and you know me not be a part of this party, man. What oh, is man. It like serving? Because I mean, he this guy he had a whole bag the other day. Wow. Yeah, I'm gonna go get another beer. Man, I'm really impressed by the taste of it. That's like sure. You want beer? You can really have the taste I mean, of pineapple, no, no, and it's like there's no hint of any any medication, right? Any medication at all. It tastes like a legit candy. That's what I'm tripping on, and I just yeah. agree. So yeah. Okay. Let's Here we remember, are. There is the couch of comfort <laughs> to cradle you in all in your all needs. in all phases of your highness. <laughs> oh, it's there. Yeah. It is oh. there. I must say. Hello. Well, all right. Oh, it's you. Oh, pineapple. Okay, I haven't tried the pineapple. Oh, that's the one God. we just that's ate. That's the one, that's bro. The one. All right, so I just got to eat one more, and I'm... Yeah, that's or it. Or two. Two. We'll see what happens. Two. Go for it. Three is we'll great for you. <laughs> Why is three? Because that know. the magic number? Yes, it is. <laughs> no more, no less. <laughs> <laughs> I'm going to pace myself. Okay. Thank you very much. All right, no problem. <laughs> Yeah, don't listen to me. Yeah, let's see me. how much... F- no. <laughs> let's see what... I'm I already know where that leads to. <laughs> the phonometer. Hmm. All right. I'm going to try... It's cold. Oh. All right. There yeah. you go. I'm caught up. I'm caught, caught up now. <laughs> Ahora. <laughs> Ahora. Here, Here we, we go. go. <laughs> Vamos, chacho. Ooh. Oof. Yes. That is good. Yes. I still like the banana... Orange or whatever, b- banana, strawberry, better. Yes, but this shit is good. Yes, mm-hmm. you will wreck yourself on this. <laughs> <shit>. Yes, <laughs> you know Uh-oh. what I'm saying? This guy is a wrecking machine. Absolutely. Yes. Um, wow, <laughs> we're almost at the time for submissions in a minute. Look, if you guys want to drop some submissions, um, you can send those to be real TV contest at gmail.com. Make sure you own it though. Yep. We don't want to be getting flagged for some shit you don't own, all right? So we just want to give you game. If you if it doesn't get on today, it will definitely get on sometime this week, if not tomorrow. Right. Mm. If you are just submitting right now. So um, that's art. That's some funny shit. That's like some paranormal shit. If you saw something you can't explain, send it over. All right. Yes, sir. You ever see, hey, Tony, you ever see some crazy shit that you couldn't explain like that? Paranormal, ghost shit, UFO, anything? Um, no, nah, I can't say that I have. Never? Mm, I'd have to give it some thought. Some shit I, you couldn't explain, never, huh? And all the traveling you've done, oh, nothing? Mm, yeah, I'd have to give that some thought. I don't know. I can't, nothing comes to mind, really. Paranormal? Yeah, because yeah, no. if you've seen some shit, you would know, like, off top. Yeah, I can't it, say that I have. It would be something ingrained. Like, felt different, like, energies, like, unnatural. I mean, yeah. I mean, that, yes, but nothing where it's, like, you know, some shit that, you know. Like, a period or, like, You know what, yeah. what, what, what gave me those crazy-ass vibes was the limelight. Oh, yeah. Going into uh, the limelight. That always <laughs> gave me a weird-ass vibe going into that spot. Yeah. There was always something about that spot. I mean... Well, it was a church with the address six six six. Sick. And oh man, <laughs> but that some system. but some crazy gigs. Ooh, crazy gigs. Jumped off yeah. there. Man. I mean, we released our Temple of Boom album. I was there for that. You was there Me for too. that. I know you was there for that. I released party. I was yeah. there, and I wasn't there for that. <laughs> <laughs> That's about right. Oh man, I was so tilted that day. Tilted. We That's didn't have to sure. perform, so we were just. No, did, well, no, no, did we? Yes, we did. See, that's how tilted I was. I don't we even did. remember that. Yeah. I don't remember. I mean, we did. We did, we did a. We did a short set. It wasn't long. Yeah. 
it was you know record because, release because party. it was a record release party and then they were letting the club in like at a certain time uh-huh. to join in with this fucking party mm-hmm. and you know the motherfuckers that came in and the shit that started happening man the bathrooms like it, they were as crazy as the club wow. inside that place was the, like uh, open and then closed down yeah, and open up the again. Drugs and, getting sold in the bathroom were crazy. Wasn't there unisex bathrooms? It, too? Yes, there was a lot of sex happening in the bathroom <laughs> in the unisex. Bathroom. Any unisex bathroom is not going to be, you know, Dude, it's not going to end up nice. Just, you would see anything. It was amazing, but well, the sound system in there was killer. If you get two people who like coke, that too. The one of them's got it, or just one. <laughs> I don't know if it's all just one. Damn, the limelight. The limelight. Shh, throwback. Just taking it back, man. That was a crazy fucking place. That was amazing. I remember the Roseland gigs. Yeah, the Roseland oh, gigs. Yeah. Man. Some That's good, right. Those are, I think I did one with you guys there. Yes. Yeah. You did one with us. Oh, yeah. You oh, DJed yeah. a few of our Haunted DJ'd, Hill and joints. You DJed a few, oh, yeah. Hell, man. What's up with that this year? Not this year, next year. I got you if you if you win. No, I'm saying, are, are you guys doing it? No, this not year? this no. year. We got we got I think some some tour jumping off. Oh, okay. Yeah. And it, it conflicts. Conflicts. Oh, okay. So well, well, I'm all year. in any time, bro. But next year we're bringing it back, and then we're gonna you know we're yes. just giving a good fresh restart, and that way we could set it up right. But if you're available in October, oh yeah, we're gonna hit you up. I have to be. So so what's like Roseland now, what what is it? It's still is the building still up, or did they tear it down all the I way? I thought they tore it down. No, I'm not sure. I don't think it's a venue anymore. It's definitely not a venue anymore. But I was wondering if they tore actually tore the building down yet. That shit was so classy, man. Oh man, we had some of the best shows there. Hell yeah, man! Great man, spot. my yeah. first, my second time seeing you guys after well after the Baco show where the Baker Boys brought you down was Roseland, New York, the Soul Assassins tour where it was Funk Doobies, House of Pain. Crazy. And you guys. Wow. And I was like, I had never, that was the first time I had seen any mosh pits in hip-hop. Wow. Cause, and they were going for it. That, sh- that show was so fucking, in, like, oh. it was Bro, insane. we had a triumphant night, right? Mm. It's great. Sold-out show. <coughs> Everybody fucking rips it. That's on the venue. Alchemist is on this with with Scotty as the hooligans, hooligans. Yep. at yeah. this time. Even they rip it, right? Because they, you know, they they had a little single out from Tommy Boy. They didn't get to put their whole album out, so I remember that there was getting some ex- good exposure through this man. Tommy Boy dropped the fucking ball on that shit, but <laughs> what is meant to be is meant to be. Yeah. Um, we all get off and, and kill the shit. The next. <laughs> Next morning, man. Oh my God, it's pandemonium. Um, I, I believe we get kicked out of the hotel because House of Pain was, you know, going crazy in there in the hotel. And then we're waiting on the bus, and our bus doesn't show up because our fucking driver um, went on a bender <laughs> or on a binger. He went on a binge. He went on a binger, <laughs> binge mission. Oh man! And fucking wrecked himself, Jeez. and the the owner of the bus company had to fly out to fucking get the bus out of where it was at, pick us up, or meet us. No, we had to meet it in the in next city or whatever in now, Jersey. Now this is when we were stuck in front of the hotel for like three two or to four, three hours, yeah, three hours, maybe or so. four. I mean, we were there, and there's people just like walking by. This is like Times Square, like right. We got a show in Jersey. We got a show in fucking Jersey or Philly or something, one of them, too, that we had to fucking drive to. And I remember when we finally got there, it's like we had to open up the doors to go straight onto the stage. Well, what happened was the bus didn't show up because the driver, right? <laughs> and then we had to fucking get in this limo. The limo's transmission drops halfway through the fucking ride. And they had to call a van, and the van picked us up, or something yeah, it was like a minivan that. or something like that. And the minivan picks us up, and we get there <clears throat> two, three minutes before we're supposed to get on stage. And we, like, literally are getting out of the car, and they're fucking running the intro. We got to fucking roll up on stage, 
from like a, that whole five hour, six hour fucking <laughs> oh, bullshit shit. right there. And then kill it. Right after that show. No shit. Yeah. Wow. But still a great show. And so was that show. It was just getting to and from that was fucked. Wow. Right? That's right. Yeah, that's, mm. some, yeah. of the, some of the shit that you have to deal with sometimes. It, it is what it is. Whoa. All right, we are going to now take submissions from um, the, the good people of the Insane Asylum right now who have uh, taken the time to put this together for us. All right, Colton. 100. We actually have a lot of submissions today, but first we're going to show them what we ate on Friday. Oh, oh. shit. All right, let's do I it. This. We got some Bart's barbecue too. right here. Shout out to Utah Hawk. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, Dustin said he's going to come back when we were both here. Yeah, salute to Bart's Dustin. Dustin. Yeah, they, they came through. They like, fucking came and killed it for ooh, us, I man. I need that in my life. Oh, man. Is that all you got? No, 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 I got a little more. Oh, well, I was going to say, man. Oh, oh, that's slightly oh, disappointing. Oh, oh, <laughs> Smash that's, burgers. Hey, that's, that's, and that's Wagyu beef. Oh, Wagyu. So good. Rest Why you? I need this in my life. Why you fucking with me? Why man? you fucking with me? Wagyu. <laughs> 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 uh, damn. Look at that. And Dude, then. <laughs> and, 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 then and then brioche like, bun. Oh, no. Motherfucking brioche. Ah, that motherfucking brioche. So good. He is the best. I like that brioche. Bart's. Oh, fucking Bart's. Oh, boy. Just he loves this me. shit. He's loving this. Dude, he's Shout out to Bart's right uh, now. Fuck yeah. Oh, look at that. Come on. Jeez. Fire. It's come every that. day. Hey, look at that. that. He said he's going to come back for us. Why you? Yes. People say a lot of things, bro. <laughs> I know, bro. Oh, I, I, you know, I feel bad that you guys missed this day, but you know, hey, look, like C minus <laughs> said, he said he'll come back. Yes. He, yeah. The return of the Jedi. Yes. Now look at that brisket. Ooh. Ooh. <laughs> shit. You know what I'm saying? Yes. Oh man, I'm dying Dude. just watching that Yo. shit. I'm just yeah, looking at it. Bro. I'm fucking dying over here. Pop, pop. Oh my god. Like oh that burger man. Is fucking getting all good. I told him. Listen, Chacho, that's some shit right there. Yo, Psycho Les was like, yo, B. Yo, B. Yo, (laughs) Yo, Yo, is he serious right now? I'm like, shit, look at it. Look at it. Look at that. Mira. Mira. See, because that's a nice, it's it's a nice, thin, fucking burger fucking flip, right? And then you got that fucking brisket coming, man. You don't need a big old thick-ass patty because then it's, nah. you ain't going to finish it. You ain't going to enjoy it. I had it. two of those. That's though. just, you did? I had a du- <laughs> no, not two burgers. two burgers. I had a double. Oh, you had the double? double? I had a double. We yeah. all had doubles. Right. Double with the brisket on top. I thought you meant you had two of those. No, I no. Thought I, I thought I saw you take one home, though. No, no, I sure. did take some bris- brisket. Oh, you did? My man, smart move. Come on, now. I'm, I'm smart with bots. So, <laughs> Hey, give me whatever you got left. <laughs> what you got left, Bob? What you got left, man? <laughs> you know I love you, right? Yeah, you oh, know that. Oh, man. Look Come at on, that. Man. He's on, don't even want to look at it. It's beautiful. Like, it's beautiful. He's like, I don't even want to see this, man. This Damn. is I was like, hey, Colton, are you done? Nope. Look at that. Look at that. Look at that. He's Hold not up. done, look son. At that. And look wait until you see what Utah Hawk sent in. Oh. I don't care oh. about that much as much. <laughs> oh, oh, man. It hurts a little. Look at that. Ooh, yeah, <laughs> <Jeez. laughs> hey. I helped. Oh, we helped cook one time. Trim the fat. Look at that. Trim the fat. Yes, trim the fat. Oh, Come on now. Oh. See, this is wrong to show a bunch of stoners right now. You know what I mean? It's I like, know. it shit activates. Yeah. Yeah, this is like Straight up. She's Fuck milky. You, <laughs> Look at that. <laughs> putting that, bad. putting that oh. on the burger, oh. y'all. Oh, man. <laughs> putting that shit on minus. the burger. Man. Look at that. But C minus. Yo. Man. But. Now he ain't done. He ain't minus. done though. He ain't done though. But look at that. C minus. Look at that. Look at that. Look at that. Look at but that beautiful. C. Oh, look at that. And then oh. that that honey mustard used, barbecue. I'm not gonna take this but, personally because the same feeling when people do drugs without me. You know? But C. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh man. Look at that. Oh jeez. Oh, it just, makes me miss it. Every minute of it. <laughs> Loving that's, every that's, minute of it. It's really awesome, oh, man. Man. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> Fuck you too, Cairo. Uh-huh. 
Ooh. Yo, so yeah, I, I took on some. I wasn't gonna disclose stuff after the show, but hey, took on some. You killed yeah. it. I understand. Totally yeah, I took on some it. extra brisket. Oh. I did that. Oh. And I said, yo, man, you need to come to Utah too on my birthday. And I think he's down. I think it's gonna be Bart's and Utah. He's planted oh. the seed. I have planted the seed. He's planted yes, the have. seed. We're at 1K. All right, cool. All right, look Thank at you that. for those likes. We need another 1K. By the way, come on, share it out. Like it. Let's go. Yeah, Colton, share it. I dare you. <laughs> I double fucking dare you. Next one. Got to show you this. Uh, Panda con carne and tuna fighter. We're kind of oh, slow today. We got dead presidents 420. Damn. Oh, number one. Dead president number one. Number, number one. It's been a battle. It's been it a has. battle, but they lost it today. And we got Big Tone up in here. Big Tone again. He says he's hitting up Dr. Green Thumbs. Well, all right, mine. I don't. They be investing. Yeah, see that Mac 11 on top right there. I saw that. Right. Oh, he's got a few bags right there. Oh, look at that. He rocks. Looks like the maraschino on the bottom there. Yep. Nice eyeball, Colton. Next. And we got Caesar Sandoval here. This is a highlighter and black marker. Hell yeah. Drawing. That's pretty dope. Mm -hmm. You rarely see people using the highlight. And he says, shout out to Stinky from Smoke and Scan. All right. Hell yeah. That's his cat, right? Yep. Mm -hmm. That cat looks like his cat. And Ezone's got a new cat, too. I mean, yeah, it's called do. Stinky. Mm. I met him. We got nice. Dr. Frost up in here. He says he's always rocking Team Icon. Right. Yeah, Team Icon. Shirt's coming soon. Word. Join the team. Of an icon. <laughs> awesome. <laughs> we got Ed Zink here. He sent in some artwork. Ooh, that's, that's dope. tight. Okay. That's tight. You did I'm your thing on that one. Mm. Nice. A little more artwork from Ed Zink. Oh, yeah. Slightly disturbing, but dope. <laughs> there we go as well. <laughs> That's tight. That's cool. Yeah. Looks like uh, John Belushi right there, right? <laughs> A little bit. <laughs> it is John Belushi. That's fucking John Belushi. That <laughs> <laughs> yeah, looks dope. <laughs> <laughs> so. Didn't win. That'd yeah, be funny if Homeboy right? says, that ain't John Belushi. <laughs> Was like, it looks like him, though. It was people that are watching, like, who's John Belushi? Uh, look up John Belushi. You look him up. He's Toga, OG. Toga, Toga, Toga. If you ever seen a mo movie called Animal House, he's in that. <laughs> if you watched Saturday Night Live in the 70s, or your parents did, you yeah, might have seen him there. That full party, for he sure. He sure did. <laughs> he partied. He, till the very a lot, of a, a lot of comedians learned how to party from him. Yep. I mean, it made, he made it look fun, but you also have to remember that personality has to be in you before you do the coke. Well, yeah. <laughs> you know, I'm just, yeah, I'm just letting you more. know, man. Like, that shit's not going to make you Mr. Friendly. <laughs> like, if you're not Mr. Friendly before you do it. His brother, Jim Belushi, said if cannabis was legalized, he think his he thought his brother would be alive today. Wow. It's possible. That's a powerful statement. It's very possible. It's possible. But then, you. you know, you got to think about it. In the 70s, it wasn't just about weed. That no, was very. Was there cocaine. was blow. It was cocaine. Cocaine. Going on, you know I mean? Not especially out yeah, there in New York. And, and, yeah, and people that that do coke, they do coke. They don't yeah. necessarily fuck exactly. with weed like that. You know what I mean? Because it doesn't what... taste like weed anymore, dude. What do you mean? I, I like it doesn't taste like the. It, like, you gotta have some fucking back of weed when you're partying like that. It's not gonna. Ah, uh, yeah, yeah, you're, you're right. not gonna appreciate that for the taste and be like, oh, this Wonder Bread. I would never smoke some Wonder Bread while I'm partying. Cause I don't want to disrespect that weed. That <laughs> I gotta have my, I gotta right. have my senses in there and be like, you know. You, yeah, right. Yeah. Feel you. And speaking of E Zone, we actually have an E Zone sighting this past weekend from JB. Oh, Mr. Black Sox. I actually Sox. have Jesus sandals, but uh, they're, they're, they're Birkenstock, so those not it. All right. Yeah, that's tight. And uh, Josh Tallboy is saying, first time with the funky tips, no hating, eight ton. Woo. He's not here to hate today, but he would give you a solid seven. Yeah, because I see the wrinkle 
right there. He would probably give you yeah. actually a f- solid five. five. <laughs> yeah, that but, sounds about right. But that's that's a good try right there. You keep you keep trying. You just got to get that the the tip end right there from the neck up tight. You you almost got it. Just that little wrinkle right there kind of. I bet you it smokes nice. Yes, probably smokes nice. Hey Tony, you good at rolling joints? Uh, not so much. There you go, Aton can't even, you know. What's the next question, with... Colton? Hey Tony, you know Psycho Les? <laughs> <laughs> yes. <laughs> I saw that this past weekend. Oh uh, yeah. <laughs> and we got little Snoop in here. He says he just cleaned the bong and he's ready to take some dabs. Oh boy. All right. That's a little monster right, right there. Because mm. that's okay. a lot of smoke. It looks like, you know, it's it's not tall, but it's fucking thick. Right. There's a lot of girth. Yeah, that Look at the girth. ice cubes in there, man. Girth over diameter. That's cool. Look at that. Dude, what f- is that a fucking titanium nail? Yep. yep. <laughs> I haven't Holy seen one of those shit, in a dude, long yeah. time. Wow. wow. That's, I mean, not to talk shit, but that's vintage, you know? It's vintage. <laughs> like, I'm glad, I'm glad you fucking, you, you're putting it to use. And then, I mean, it looks like it has an e-nail adapter. So if it's an e-nail, that's perfect. It's probably an e-nail. Yeah, it looks like an e-nail. Yeah, bro. I'm not, I, that's why I said I'm not talking shit. It's just I haven't seen one of those in a minute. I'm glad people still, it just made no sense to, if you had well, an email. Well, look, he's, look, he's got to, a, he's got to connect on his fucking cookie yeah, shit right there. Kidding. So, you know, he's, he's up to date with shit. He ain't tripping. I, I, I think that's for an email right there. Yeah, it looks like the, you have the coil there. Yeah, the it looks like, yeah. It, yeah, I remember when we used to have those. Yeah, it's but just it's a pain work. in the ass because if someone gets too high and forgets, to no, turn what this it is, shit off. it's not even, it's not hard, man. They, like it's really not hard. I'll break it down to you on YouTube. It's not hard to keep an email clean, y'all. Mm-hmm. If you guys have these fucking nails that you guys waste huh? ten Q-tips to clean that fucking spinner, <laughs> you can fucking wipe down the titanium shit. Nobody ever wants to clean up that little black shit that, that leaves in the titanium shit. Once you put a glob up in there, that's all it takes, maintenance. And then you get a little torch. Put that shit on top, burn it off, start burn fresh. That dog. Shit. Fuck that shit. Let him know. I still have my email shit. Let them know. It's That's... just like my dog will just get it with his tail and knock it over, so I learned not to put it on the, you know, yeah, the don't table. Yeah, burn his tail. Especially now with my cat. Nah, he, nah your yeah. cat would probably fuck mm. that thing up. Yeah, he'll burn himself. He'll be like, ow. Yeah. And we got Polo Cushion here. He says he's just blazing it up during the podcast. Yes. Showing some of the flower. I got you bypasses joint nice. real quick. Like, you don't need to see that. Right, nice. <laughs> and he wants to thank Be Real and Cairo for sending him the Rome. Yes. You just thank Be Real. <laughs> Damn. Yes. <laughs> Damn. Uh, wow. Ice cold. It's ice cold. Next. And we got Queso 57. He sent in some oh. tacos. Oh. What are they? Some shrimp tacos. Shrimp. Oh, yeah, you pass. That's a hard pass, man. Not for me. <laughs> I would take that. Fuck that uh, shit. Is that guacamole and stuff in there? Oh, yeah. Oh, no. Nah, you fucking up, bro. Some bobo You could always put that on the side, No, man. no. Once it's already in there, it's already mixed That's in. That's not for you? Yeah, nah, nah. Because in taste, I'm going to taste it. Oh, yeah. You hate avocados. You know, avocado. the camarones should have been chopped up, too, man. Come you on, man. You guys are those too are... complicated. B, those are, go back. Those are whole ass camarones. Like, those are, like, those but if they've been, that. but if, but if the tail's been taken off, so fucking what? No. That's just all whole, bro. Chop it up a little Fuck bit, shrimp. man. Dry weight. You know what, what I mean? I'm on. Keanu and them. I'm Fuck just shrimp. saying, my Are preference. you hearing your boy right here? Those are jalapenos. I would try, those aren't bro. Fucking... I'm not saying I wouldn't one, try one. But... Okay, yeah, well, that has a little yeah. bit of glock right there. Look at that. I just prefer that to see guac. Whole, whole right. on the looks, cocktail. That looks like Yeah, I guess they're, they're, they're hidden with them halas on top of them. And that right. and that avocado don't look like the green is so it's been <laughs> out it's been out a little minute aged yeah so it's aged oh man you can't even judge you don't Save need to the judge avocado for me. Uh, yeah. Why bubble you hate- guts Damn, I don't like hate- the nopales but I try one why are you hating on the avocado like just because as a food person or vlogger. I would rather have the avocado on the side. You know what I'm saying? But yeah. th- those weren't bad to me. I would have fucked with those. Fuck shrimp. I told them, dude. Sorry. Sorry you're traumatized like that. And Shoddy Boom sent this in. They want you guys to rate Cairo's joint. Uh, oh, what? Oh, that's a solid two. <laughs> oh. <laughs> so, first time I'd have to say negative three. No, I'm just kidding. It's a solid two right there, man. That's cool. He's all right. He's getting better. His joints used to like, really oh, not be man. good. This no. is like E forever. No, no. This is hurting my eyes. This is hurting my fucking eyes, man. What is that? That's the desk I destroy every week. <laughs> True. 
Yeah. It's right next to mine. Needs to <laughs> clean that desk up. There hasn't been anything lately, though. Yeah, because needs I to clean here. the desk up. Yeah. Oh, that's, that's for sure. Hilarious. So I haven't been here enough to do stuff, but I'm oh, thinking of stuff. Put him in the corner. <laughs> Next. We got a little uh, porn sent in for Bobo. Oh, no. wow, Utah Hawk sent in some cheese porn. <laughs> some cheese porn. Jeez, okay. Look at that. He loves it. Okay. Damn. Okay, cheesy. Damn. All right. Are you getting off, dude? <laughs> <laughs> you getting off on this <laughs> cheese porn? <laughs> <laughs> Don't do that again, dude. <laughs> <laughs> Are you just missing uh, missing the wine? You can't show that much cheese. I thought he was going to melt up. it. We're still going. We're still going. Yeah, well, okay. he stopped. Okay. Shout out to whoever sent that cheese, too. I, you know, we have one left down there. That was great. Oh, the dip. Oh, oh that's a look dip at that. right there. Oh. Dip, 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 dip. It's amazing. All right. Jeez. Okay. Jeez. And the hawk also sent in a brisket as Man. well. Okay. To Look go the with hawk. the nachos. All right, let's Stab see. It. Let's see how this goes. All Look right, let's hawk. see. Oh. All right. <laughs> Tacos. All right. All right. Off top. Okay. 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 That's the brisket you put okay. out Okay. All right. <laughs> 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 All right. Yeah. Cut up. Yeah. Okay. Damn. The hawk. Tacos okay. I'm, I'm not mad at that. I'm not mad at that. No, oh, I ain't mad at that. It's nice. Yeah. We got another. I one. actually am kind of mad at that because it's not right here. True. Yeah. But I can get over it. <laughs> Let's go. And Pistouche sent this in about eight times again. Hi, Hi I'm, I'm high. high. <laughs> Hi, he looks I'm like high. one of those characters ah, from the ah, Kleenex ah, commercial. Ah, <laughs> from the Kleenex commercial. <laughs> yeah, like they have like these, they look like the Who, the people from Whoville. Right. <clears throat> yeah. Okay. I feel you. Whoville. Wow. Hutan. Hutan. Damn, is that his OnlyFans profile pic? Oh. <laughs> oh. oh. That's cold-blooded That's probably he has that video of those people fucking in the hotel in his OnlyFans Oh, oh <laughs> man. Oh. All right. Remember when he did that? <laughs> Low blows. Let's go. <laughs> Damn, you don't forget. And oh. Victoria Pastouche also sent in this meme right here. Smoky eyes. Yes. Mm. Yep. Two different types. Indeed. And that seems to be it for submissions today. Wow. wow. <coughs> That's Man. right. We started early. We did? It was my fault. Did you want you you in a rush? Tried to skip steps here. Okay. Do you have a mix today? No. <laughs> it's Monday. Oh. I mean You didn't want to do a mix? No, it's Monday, but Mondays, we, don't we don't normally mix on Monday. I mean, you can't mix, I don't I you? I could. Yeah, be, it might be cool to do a mix. Why are you trying to coax, coax <laughs> me to do, <laughs> to do a mix, dude? Stand up, dude. You, you got a cramp. Sorry. You got a cramp? Yeah. What's going on, dog? <laughs> oh, you got to contain this shit. Like, <laughs> oh, shit. Like Just breathe. Yo. Just breathe. Meditation. No. Meditation. No, you have a cramp like a Charlie horse? Yeah, like in the back of Oh, yeah, yo, he, he was trying <laughs> to stuff. contain it. And I'm just like, yeah, you just stand up. Shit. There's no way you can contain it. It's gonna hurt. Hey, man. that is technique from Stone to like, oh shit. <laughs> oh, you need another joint, do you? <laughs> but he's <laughs> <laughs> yeah, man. <laughs> man we... <laughs> he's like, <laughs> he's smiling. He said, "This ain't funny, motherfucker. This should yeah. hurt." <laughs> I'm well, I'm a hydrate. <laughs> yeah, hydrate, man. You know, you got to breathe right through that. That's the thing. People tense up and they forget to breathe and it makes it worse. I no, he kicked the shit out of my leg right now. <laughs> I'm sorry. <laughs> <laughs> hey, Rob, yo, yo, I was like, That yeah. shit came on, so my apologies, dude. <laughs> like, he, said, he said he kicked the shit out of my leg. Like, yo, what I do? What I do, Bobby? No, no. no, no. Bobby, you all right, Bob? Oh, my yeah, God. Yeah, it's getting better. Yo, you got him good because he had to rub this shit. He's like, hey, man, that shit hurt, man. Yeah, no, I be getting him too, though, right behind my um, the, like the right on the right on the bottom, like up the, thigh, behind the your hamstring thigh. behind your thigh, behind Get your him thigh. a banana, behind dude. Your thigh, bro. Sometimes <laughs> I be getting 
Oh yeah. Have you ever? I mean, have you had one like as that has woken you up out of a dead sleep? Yeah, that's no. the word. Those are the words. Oh, those are the no. words. I've never had them in my You just stand shit, up, yo. You just gotta stand up, man. You're fucking bugging me out right now. Yo. I'm probably high off this fucking this fruit yo, juice. You yo, you, you gotta, gotta stand up. A crab up. waking you up from your sleep. Yeah, nah. You've had this. Yeah, yo. You, you gotta. Yeah. Yo, your I've muscle. Had, I've not like had your that. muscle would be high. Like your cat. Like for me, your calf. It'll go from regular to like, and you'll see it tense up. Like, you'll see the little muscle tense up, and then you're just like, oh, what the fuck? And, and if you lay there, it's going to keep going. So, like, from what I realized, you just got to stand up yeah. and just, just stretch that muscle out. Yeah. You got to stretch yeah. it out, stand yeah. up, because you can't lay there. That's just No, gonna, you can't lay there. And, that and, shit will make and you then, throw And then, you and then moving around like, oh, 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 oh that, that shit ain't going to work either. <laughs> no. The more you move. The more you move. My cash shit is more. <laughs> <laughs> It was, yeah. No. Yeah, there you go. It's exactly you know what right mean? now. Oh, the crazy shit is that my brother has gotten that in his foot, in his toes and shit. Oh, yeah. That's, uh, that Charlie is... Horse. So, and that, that brings him to tears and he's Ooh. and laughing at the same time because his toes is like fucked up like... Bang! And he's laughing because his shit looks real alien and shit like that. You know what I mean? Like his shit's like all fucked up, but this shit's like in pain. Yeah. And I'm like, don't touch it, don't touch it. I want to touch it. Fucking yeah, a cramp is crazy, man. <laughs> yeah. You get him. You just yeah, straight cease. But you know what? You gotta just breathe through it. Yeah, it's happening. And not and not <laughs> ten, and not tense up. You gotta breathe through <laughs> it. You gotta <laughs> breathe through it and not tense. Up. Yeah, that shit was straight that was up. Hard. It was hard though. Like what? I'm like, what? you notice the lack you, of posture right now yo, is very you evident that this fucking thing hurt as fuck. That's you weren't breathing. Up, were you man. breathing through it I though? Breathe what? I don't even know what the fuck I'm doing right now. I'm just trying not to like. You weren't breathing, so you not. just gotta breathe. You like? Fuck. I've been breathing. I just mean, sock the screen, it's like, dude. <laughs> just sock the screen. Already. Why don't you stand up? I, I'm trying. Hey. <laughs> <laughs> He's an hey, easy. <laughs> so what, what step at a time? Yeah, one step at a time, bro. Yeah. As a team, we can do this. <laughs> Damn, we'll Bobo, you're tickled by this. <laughs> I mean, it, it was kind of hilarious, bro. I was like, because you saw him, I was like, why are you leaning back like this? Yeah, <laughs> dude. Like, and then I was just like, oh, fuck. Yeah, and I was like, for a second, I was like, damn, this fool's going to faint, and then we're going to have to pick him up. You know what I mean? Like, just to... Yo, like, because it looked like, I was like, damn, dude, this fool's going to faint. Yeah, you know, yeah, either you're going to faint or you're going to shit yourself. No. <laughs> nah, Don't do that. No. Imagine if you had a cramp while having to shit yourself. <laughs> oh, <man. laughs> That would be Ooh, horrible. That's two strikes uh, against no, you. No, you wouldn't get any help. No. No. No, no. no man is like. <laughs> Everybody would be running. <laughs> it's a yo. 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 Man, throw, throw an ice pack or throw something to him. <laughs> you oh go my God. handle that. Handle that, dude. Motherfuckers will be out of here in a hurry. Oh. <laughs> Fuck it. You gotta say, yo, Stumble bro. Stumble it down the stairs and shit. Yo, bro, it's one or the other, man. Yeah, you can't, yeah, you can't yeah. be doing both here. No. Yeah, there we are. <laughs> and we're back. You're trying to multifunction over here. Look at this. Just yeah. like we were. Yeah. <laughs> back. Hey, not for nothing, but those, um, that fruit juice. Yeah, I yeah, there's some going on. There, there, there's some going on. I, I told them. I can guarantee they're working. I was there, dude. Straight up. No, there's there. And everybody. there's more. Yeah. yeah. That's what I mean. Yeah. There you go. Mm-hmm. There it is. How are you feeling there, Tony? I'm all right. I'm wondering when I stand up. <laughs> what's, what's that going to be like? I'm scared to stand up. <laughs> Sit right here, bro. <laughs> yeah. Is it fuck that. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <clears throat> Sorry. Uh-huh. But uh, yeah, overall, I feel great, man. Happy to be here. Thanks for, uh, thanks for uh, letting me come through. Hell yeah, familia. Well, always good to see you, man. Yeah, That's man. right. Always, man, for sure. Yeah. The- the motherfucking fruit <coughs> juice work. Everybody's straight mellowed the fuck out. Wonder mm-hmm. Brett. Man. I can hear God that. Damn. Dude, this shit is like. Say hitting. what? I said, I can hear that. Hey, Colton, yeah. why don't you eat some of them, <laughs> then? <laughs> no, yeah. no, he needs to run the show. Run nah, the bro, he needs shit, to take man. some of these right now. Come on, yeah. Colton. Get on our level. Bro. Throw them over there. <laughs> eat them. Eat five. Mm. Oh. <laughs> 
That's what the Godfather would do if he Lonzo was here. Lonzo played you for a fool, Colton. <laughs> Johnny eats five. <laughs> Oof. That's the new band. Johnny. Johnny eats five. Johnny eats five. Uh. Five yeah. what? Five. I wonder how many of those to get Godfather fucked up. Five, probably, or maybe no, the five whole bags. bag. Mm-hmm. Five bags. Five bags. <laughs> nah, I would. I would say the one bag. Yeah, I think one bag. Nah. I think one Bobby. bag. Bobby. Bobby. Yeah. All right, two bags. I'm no, gonna I say th- I think one bag. I think three bags could take him out. Three bags can take him yeah, out. Three bags take, take him out. Three bags would put him to sleep. Yeah, <laughs> you know he's gonna be like, oh, now you volunteer with me for stuff. No, add, add some flips to that. <laughs> add some, <laughs> add some flips to that. Add some flips to that. If you don't do it, do it like that. No, nah, I'm just saying this is a, a scientific mm-hmm. hypothesis. Okay. You know. I think that three of these could take the Godfather out. Because mm. he's a big-ass dude. I don't know. Bobo could probably take down two or three bags himself. That's the chat room. I don't know. I, I can, I, you know. But I mean, it's like, <laughs> do you want to have that much sugar? You get No, you don't. Lines. You don't want to have that much sugar, but no they way. taste very good. Yeah. And if I wanted to. They taste to, really good. And it's very easy to eat a whole bag. And the fact that they don't taste like medicated, <laughs> you're going to get in trouble. You know what I mean? Because you're going to feel it. Oh, yeah. You know? Oh, yeah, it's happening. Yeah, It'd be or, nice to bring those to the movie theater. Or yeah. forget it is happening outside right now. <laughs> like, I think the about- like sometimes when I'm like okay when it oh, passes you, you heard it too yeah I'm, I mean dude when, usually when they pass by you know I feel safe it's like uh, alright cool they go but when they stay there I'm like oh shit yeah it's like a movie thank God, God we have no, that we got game. Bobo here we're all right yeah Bobo's in <laughs> here waiting call your peoples dude they, tell, yeah. them to, tell, tell hold them. up let me let me get the officer Coleman hey did anybody get a fucking Amber Alert uh, this weekend yo this is just crazy. Some people, some people that don't live in LA, <laughs> some people fucking got this thing that says stay away from uh, Wilshire and Rampart or some shit like that, right? Because Antifa is there or some bullshit like that. Mm-hmm. And these are my like Xavier got it and Ray got it, but I did it, and I'm just like, how do they, how do they know who to send it to? I didn't get it. I didn't get it. I didn't get it. Nobody else got it. No. No. You got it, right, Ray? Yeah. Really? Yeah. yeah. I didn't get it. I didn't get, I didn't get shit. And I usually uh, I usually get them shits, you know. Nah, I ain't getting nothing. Well, yeah, and this just in from Pedro News. Uh, the abandoned church is on fire on the other side. Of the- <laughs> oh, that's, <laughs> that's what that yeah. was. Oh, okay. <laughs> no, that's what that is because you just don't fucking, you know. That's yes. an abandoned church. It's flammable. There's oh, a bunch yeah. of homeless in there. For sure, there's like. The one across from like the. Right, Yeah. If yeah. I want to know what the fuck is going on, I just, you know, citizen. Citizen yeah. fucking lets you I be know. I'm going out there and trolling, dog. Man, oh just, man, it's the best. A person <laughs> coming, uh, attacking people <laughs> with an axe, you know, at the CVS pharmacy. Like, what the fuck? You know what I mean? Yeah, people are going crazy these days. They are really, really going, going nuts. They're going for it. You should so, have a talk, or no, I'm sorry, you should have Cairo go over there on scene and report next to the fire. <laughs> 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 you like want he, your report from in the like he used to do at the Grito store. I'm right here next to the fire, <laughs> y'all. <laughs> Man. <laughs> next style. Yes. Fire engulfing. All right. It's time we open up the, the doors to the insane asylum. Oh. That means the live chat for all y'all motherfuckers watching for the first time. Uh, we invite you. You can uh, ask a question, give a shout out, make a comment. Um, whatever. You know what I'm saying? You can do that via Super Chat to expedite it. All right. So uh, we invite you now. Let me find the key to the door. Let's do this. We got Michael Valdivia in here. He sent us a few messages in here. He's saying thanks again, B-Real TV crew, for my sister's birthday shout out. She absolutely loved it. And she's asking, be real, where did you film Ain't Going Out Like That? Damn, I don't remember. It was here in Los Angeles somewhere. Uh, wasn't it in, like, um, the Griffith, Griffith I think, yes, Park? Yes, I think it was Griffith Park, yeah, with Gary Gray, at Franklin Gary Gray. Yeah, I was there. You were there. So was Duke from Psycho Realm. And who else? That was a lot of peeps. Yeah. And, yeah, everybody was driving their car. And the scene, and everybody's driving the car away. Yeah. That was everybody's car. Yeah. That was a cool video. 
And Michael is also saying, best podcast in the world, blaze up insane all day. He's also saying, anyone who dislikes this podcast smokes boof. And also, he's got his bong packed, hits from the bong, blaze it up, and he hopes everyone had a great weekend. And he's asking C minus, what's good? What's good? Uh, just tell him. This pineapple uh, Wonder Bread edibles are fucking pretty outstanding right now. Yeah, I could tell. <laughs> Happy Monday. <laughs> yeah. And we got Dominic Darpino in here saying, getting to watch this live while trimming my buds before jarring is a great birthday gift. A handwritten doctor's note would have been better, though. Team Icon. I don't know. <laughs> wow. Damn. I guess it just depends on the day with those notes. Damn. <laughs> Sorry. Sorry, Bobo. Quit looking at me like that. Team doc. of the Icon. He's just thinking no. <laughs> Fucking hate. Damn. I'll make you a new note. Aw. Imagine <laughs> the new one says, no, here's, your fucking, oh, here's <laughs> your fucking note. Here's your fucking note this time, fucking, bro. Here's the second fucking note. Here's your second no, fucking note. Let's move on to other business. <laughs> Don't ask me for another, signed the doctor. Here's your second and third fucking note. <laughs> now let's move on to other business. <laughs> Gotta love it. <laughs> you see how it's tickling you right there? Next one. <laughs> and uh, Ty Online EXP, he sent us a super chat. Thank you so much, Ty. Oh, yeah. And Patrick Morales is saying C minus. Can we get an ah oh, yeah? Ah oh, yeah. Mm. All right. Need to practice a little bit. Let's see. Damn. Yeah, I gotta get back in. Dude. You gotta get back in. Yeah, I just gay. Yeah, I just got back. Okay. <laughs> Damn. He's on with the C. He took f- four. How many? Ah oh, yeah. Four. Oh, <laughs> you. See, two, four. I to get high. We got Gorilla Strong in here saying, great seeing C-minus and E-zone back. Triple flip for each of them. Mm. And, he's saying, and he's saying, welcome back to the Firm Vados. <laughs> right on. Right on. Yeah, Hell you, yeah. You Thank you so much. <laughs> Good to be back. Magnificent. With E-zone and everybody. And we got David Eminem 93 saying, what's up, fam? Guys, did you guys catch The Heist on Netflix yet? I have yeah. not seen The Heist yet. Nah. And he's saying it's good. You guys got to check it out. Word. Nah, man. I'll take your word for it. And we got <laughs> Todd Watson in here. <clears throat> Todd Watson saying, what up, fam? Check out the series The 100-Foot Wave about big wave surfing. It's awesome. Much love. So I'm going to put that in the checklist. Pat McCartney. I directed uh, it. Documentary six-parter. Woo! That's a good one. I'm on episode four. Yeah, I binge watched that shit. Ooh, I had to stop myself. I had to go to sleep last night after Seriously. watching all four. Stop shit. And there's Recommend two it. more. No, dude, watch them all. I'm going to take no. it slow. You don't have to boss me. And we got McLovin420 in here saying, I'm a vivid dreamer, and I also had dreams about UFOs. I have cool, good dreams and also have scary nightmares ever since I was a kid. You're not alone. Damn, there you go, man. To trip me out, man. Sweet Mary, mother of God, Jackpot. Yeah, I think that. I saw somebody staring from them, but whatever. Nice question. (laughs) (laughs) Why are you looking at me? Because. (laughs) (laughs) Next question. (laughs) Next one. We got Victoria Pistouche in here. She's saying some people Mm. in the general chat thought I got blocked, and she's saying, LOL, nah, I ain't going nowhere. Of course oh, not. Cool. Aton will block you quick. Oh yeah. <laughs> don't let yeah. him get. Yeah. Don't let that happen. Don't let that happen. Guaranteed. Or on the, on Keanu and them. Are guaranteed. And we got Sassy Stoner Mom in here saying a moment of silence for all the weed we ditched running from the cops back in the day. Oh wow. Short oh, I, I didn't ditch any weed. <laughs> <laughs> I never ditched it. I, I you know I tried to keep it. Same. Same. Did, you know. There's a few bags I had to sacrifice, unfortunately, but yeah, it all comes back around. McLovin420 sure. is also saying Mr. Nice Guy was the best weed delivery service in New York. Hmm. Raw it. I fucking told him. I was there. I heard it. Next. And we got Wasky Wabbit saying, I want to talk to Samson. Hashtag 5150. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Word. Me too. 
And we Man. got Simple Man in here saying New York and Mexico and New Mexico legalized the same day. Much respect. Yeah. Yeah. About time. About time. Better late than never. Agreed. Catch up. And we got Robert Bronte in here saying, Robert from Colorado, yeah, we have four ounces and 32 grams of concentrates right now on medical and two ounces and 16 grams of concentrates for rec on January 8th or on January 1st, eight grams. All right. All right. I fucking told him. I was there. Talked to the mayor when I went there. Called it, bro. There it is. Right. And we That's got awesome. Victoria Pastouche also in here saying, can we get Method Man on the podcast? Wave him. Tell Go him on his IG right now, all oh. you motherfuckers. I dare you. I, let's see let's if you'll do him. it. Go on his IG, Method Man official. You know I believe not. is what it is. <laughs> no. What do you think, C-? I, I mean, I believe in him, but I want to be lagging on the do waves lately, bro. Really? Yeah. Come on, man. Come on, guys. I believe in you. No oh, man, come on. We can a, we can get meth on here. Yeah, we don't need your stinking wave. <laughs> <laughs> I'm just kidding, but uh, it would be yeah. nice. Yeah, it'd be nice because Positive, he would bro. know that y'all motherfuckers want him on the show. Yeah, he already knows, but it would I be fucking nice. I told him, dude. You were there. You well, told the fucking him. first moment. I told him. You were Did there you? when you told him. I was fucking there, dude. See, try to tell him. And we got Junior B in here saying, look, of course, Kelly Bud is the best, but New York will come hard with the East Coast strain soon. Just watch. With the sour. Hope so. Oh, I love some good sour I think right they'll now. get some different strains out there. Yeah. It's Dash. not going to just be the sour. sour. The, the runs. There'll be a lot of different things. There'll be some, there'll be some good things that'll be coming out. Oh, they'll be having you know? some no, shit. No doubt. Yeah. No doubt. No I doubt. I agree. I know New York fools. They'd be having some flavors. I'm like, damn, yeah, shit made it out there. <laughs> Do you have a preference, Tony? Um, no, the sour for me is the... It's the one. It's the, it's one, the staple. You know. Yeah. Hell yeah. That's the New York swing right there. It's so good, though. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. sour I mean, for, for me, anything from out here is all fire, so I don't really... You know? Yeah. Every choice is... At this point, <clears throat> you know, not, you know, super connoisseur with it, but... I'm sure if it's coming from out here, probably that fire. Yeah. 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 That ain't wrong. Uh, Not at all. I told him, dude. Uh, and yeah. we got Jamie Rodriguez in here. She's saying, it's weird, though. I can have four 24-packs of beer and five bottles of liquor, but an ounce of weed is an issue. Yeah. Well, crazy, well, right? It is crazy. <laughs> but, uh, you know, keep the faith. Things might, you know, turn around. Be happy where we're at. Yeah, dude. You know what I mean? <laughs> Get on a plane. Mm -hmm. And we got my favorite asylum member in here, Karina Karina. She's yeah. in the super chat. She's asking, hi, Colton. How'd your weekend go? Love, wow. Karina. Oh. So, oh. Colton. Oh. Colton. Colton. No, wait, wait, wait. We have to address him properly. Bolton. Bolton. What's up, B? How did your weekend go? You know, it was pretty good. Me and my mother, we took a trip to Santa Barbara. Well, all right. Ate some food, walked around. Hell yeah. Took a nice little cruise. You know, it was a good time. You smoke with her? Uh, I brought my dad pen with. And oh. I even brought the uh, Rome with, but I just, I didn't get to it at that time. Didn't have much time. Um, but yeah, I've been dabbing a little bit at the apartment. Just I haven't been smoking know. the flower, though. Don't want the whole apartment to kind of stench up a little yes, bit. Yes, that's oh, loud. Nah, dude. Bless yes, it. So I stick with the concentrate. <laughs> that's cool. Don't, Baptize it. Don't take his own <laughs> advice ever. <laughs> say it's sage. <laughs> say it's <laughs> say it's sage. No, it's a new sage. You it's this new yet. sage. You didn't hear about it? You can't <laughs> argue with my religion. <laughs> 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 Oh yeah, you know oh, she might great. she might just say, "Yo, yo, Colton, you smoking that shit again?" <laughs> you know what I mean? She might just bust it out like that. That reefer is that reefer. If that you're reefer. not gonna share, I want you out of here. Was... Give me some of that grass. She did say Wonder Bread's gummies or fruit chews did look a little interesting. So who knows? Nice. Oh boy. Hell yeah. All right. They are. And we got Wilfred Cyrus in here saying, "Much love, Dr. Greentham crew." But, uh, what are some of your guys' favorite cuts of beef? Ribeye. Oh. <sighs> um, T-bone. You know Sirloin. You know, uh, the, 
<laughs> Bubba was like Let's ground beef. The ground beef. <laughs> <laughs> lean. He said I like that ground beef. That, you know <laughs> that lean <laughs> ground beef. I like that ground beef and shit, you know. <laughs> that 80-20 or 90-10. <laughs> yeah, we try to keep it to the 90-10, but I was all about that 80-20. Shit, for a while I was in that 60-40. Mad, gra- mad grasa. Next one. And we got McLovin for <laughs> one. <laughs> <laughs> and we got McLovin for twenty in here saying Cypress Hill documentary. Looking forward to it. Oh, Word. Oh yeah. So am I. Yes, we are. Yeah. Word. And we got Jeff Rowe in here. He's saying, want to give a shout out to Toka, Bobo, and Be Real for making the blueprint of what makes hip hop. You guys being Latino inspires me and makes me proud. Jeff Rowe, what up, yo? Jeff Rowe. Thank What's you, man. the word? You know? Yeah. Just trying to make Thank a little you. noise. You know, have some fun with it, right? Yeah. Oh, man. Make sure you put those scuff shoes away, all right? Ooh. <laughs> Ouch. And we got Dr. Frost in here saying, hey, hey, y'all. Welcome back, C-. minus. Hope you had a good vacation, and hope y'all had a great weekend. Thank you. Oh, yeah. And right back at you. And yeah, he's saying this, you. I'll ask early, can Step Tone join the mix on Friday? <laughs> uh, That's up to him, really. Yeah. I mean, it's really it. Yeah. I'll hear from him. Wave. I'll call, I'll hit him up. Or wave him. Wave him. And we got Paxton Hall in here. He's saying, yo, B, I just booked Pat's Barbecue, the best in Salt Lake City, what? to cater the wedding. What? <laughs> Are you trying to entice me? Is that what you're trying to do? That's that's what it's called. Just with food is always the blur. B. I noted that. I took notes. I was there. Food, they're really the accommodations, everything. They're really like setting the stage for you. <sighs> Just bring your weed. Bring bring them some Wonder Bread. Oof. Choose. Pause yeah. right there. Next oh, one. Gone. <laughs> Tomorrow he'll be like, yo, B, I got you hotel room. <laughs> Accommodations. I didn't even know. And we got Justin in here saying, thank you for another Unwinding the Mind Monday. He says, always mm. look forward to you men continuing to inspire and keeping it real. Right on. Thank you very much. What you said. And we got King of the Eight saying, hey, yo, Cyprus. Yo. Second, (laughs) he's saying today would have been my brother's B day. Can you take a shout out for him? Word up! Happy birthday! Happy birthday! Happy birthday! What's his name? Happy Uh, Mario. Happy birthday, Mario! Mario, happy birthday! Positive times to you, and um, you know, may you not be around any boof on this day or any other day, but make sure definitely not today. Because it's your birthday. Be around, you know, solid ones. All right. That shit was crazy. And we got a super sticker sent in from E Zone. Oh! Team Lemons. <laughs> Team Lemons. Oh! I mean, I mean I'm mean, i sure the pairs are going to make their. Yeah. going to be around, bro. I think there's a lot more pairs than lemons, man. Ooh, I think so. Because nobody's ever slid all the way to the right. Fucking jerks. <laughs> <laughs> Next. And let me see if I get this right. We got Jorge in here saying shout out to my fellow Boracua, Tony Toka. No, okay, let's try this again. What did you say, Horacua? No, Boracua. Okay, oh. it's Bor. Boricua. 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 <laughs> there you go. Whoa, that was what close he, enough. That's what that was. <laughs> that was <good. laughs> shout out to my Boricua. fellow Boricua, Tony Toka. <laughs> he said Boricua. <laughs> Boricua. 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 <laughs> I was thinking of Lily, no, Barracuda, something like that. Barracuda. Barracuda. <laughs> Barracuda. <laughs> what? Oh, shit. <laughs> Thank or you. Weequa. All right, there we go. That was actually really fucking good right there. Uh, <laughs> I need that clip right there. Oh, yeah. <laughs> we got I'm you. We got that clip right there. <laughs> And Jorge's also saying, E-Zone, we ready for the giveaway. Oh, thank you, man. Yeah, it's on my page, E-Zone the Firm. It's very simple. Giving some insane premium goods away. And we got Kimberly T in here saying, I'm just here to get the Spando Ballet true out of all y'all. The Spando Ballet. The what? Spando Ballet. Man, 
<laughs> yeah, that's gonna take you getting at least up to fifteen hundred. <laughs> yeah, we can't just break we can't out. Just break into out with that amazing man. harmonies. Just if you if we can't get to fifteen hundred, yeah, yeah. trying to call us out and shit. And exactly, nah, man. You know what I'm saying? Nothing we under fifteen hundred. We, call, we calling you up. Yeah. You know, you know, at least give us a fifteen hundred. Then we'll fifteen hundred, maybe. I mean, fifteen hundred is considered. You know. You know what I'm saying? I was there. Before you hear the sound of my soul, you got to hit fifteen hundred. <laughs> <laughs> wow, well said. I don't know. I don't know if they could do it, but <laughs> Kimberly T is also saying thanks for keeping us all in good energy. Thank you very much, and likewise. And the Gooch is saying, "Yo, B." Yeah. If we hit 2,000 likes, do shoot them up. Oh, shit. Ooh. Do I even remember that one? Sure you do. You wrote it. Hey, fuck off. <laughs> you don't know if I remember or not. Yeah, you were the um, sure. You did it. <laughs> you were there. You remember. Mm, no, I don't remember that one. I would have to listen to it two, three times. And then I got it. Just That's saying. Nice. That's a good one. We got Wasky Wabbit in here saying, E-Zone, I know the feeling. I had a 125-pound pit bull who shattered my bong with its tail. 125-pound pit bull? God damn, that's a big-ass pit bull, dude. <laughs> that is a big... <laughs> that's a person. <laughs> that, is a, that is a big pit bull. It's like how much Cairo weighs. Or a heavy pit bull. <laughs> and but... Wasky Wabbit saying, big ups to Tony Tokta. And shout out to the crew in all the 5150s. Yeah. Hell yeah. Hell Thank yeah. you for being here. Peace. I told him, dude. I was there. We got Vladimir Green saying, how about our man Tony Hawk competing in the X Games last weekend? He's that guy. Salute to Tony, Salute. man. He can do that. He's a Tony legend. Mm-hmm. You know what I'm saying? He was on there. And he's saying, and shout out to 12-year-old guy, Heary, for doing the 1080 at the X Games. Salute. Motherfuckers are doing some amazing things, man. 12-year-old. 1080. They were supposed to add breakdancing to the Olympic Olympics, yeah. too. Yeah. I don't know if they've done it yet, but... I think they, they they're have. going to do it this year. It starts on Friday. Oh, it does. What, the Olympics? Yeah. Holy shit, now this is the first year that the Olympics... No that, spectators, right? I, I don't know. I don't think they're having any spectators. But I'll tell you what, that would be dope to watch breakdancing on the Olympics. Hell yeah. I mean that shit is everything right there. I mean, that, like it, it goes. To, that's a representative of hip hop culture right there. Where do you think, as far as around the world, where do you think you'd had some really good contenders from? Our Everywhere. You think so? Everywhere, because as late as it got to some places, in terms of skill and what their abilities are, they caught up in that regard. Like there's bad motherfuckers everywhere. Yeah. It's just you know. Who's going to flex the hardest is all it is. Yep. yep. Okay. I think so. Because it's just like skating and anything else, right? There's a scene there, right? There's a scene of skating everywhere. And there's like from the pool of talent around the world, there's bad motherfuckers everywhere. And they all go to, you know, the certain tournaments and compete. But like everywhere has their, that yeah. guy. You know mm-hmm. what I'm saying? That or guy. Or female. Right. Because they're killing it, too. Yeah. And it's the same with breakdancing shit. There's, there are motherfuckers that were into hip-hop everywhere. Mm-hmm. And to emulate the culture of it, they, you know, immersed themselves in it. So, you know, some got nice on the turntable. Some got nice on the mic. Some got nice on the floor. Some with the art. Yeah. All that shit. So, sure. you know, I think it's it's pretty much, you know... It's That's it's right. spread out enough to where you could have this and mm. have this type of battle of, t- you know, break dancing in the Olympics. Crazy. I can't wait. Word up. Next one. And we got DJ the Lizard saying the edibles <laughs> did their thing. <laughs> did they? I think you are correct. And DG is saying Bobo faded because he took his shades off. Best podcast ever. Mm. <laughs> I didn't come with my shades today. Ooh. Yeah. Moses. So you didn't. That's true. I didn't. You wow. didn't Moses. come with your shades. So, you know, but am I faded? Yeah. Yeah, probably. Why not? Oh, no, not probably. He is. That's neither here nor there. And if he's I'm, not yet, he will be. I'm here. Right here. He's not in a portal. 
<laughs> That's for sure. <laughs> and PandaCon Carne sent us a super sticker saying cool. Ah, with hell the yeah, look at that. He's going right. to take that. Look at that purr. I know those bitch ass pairs running. Yeah, out. baby. Yeah. And then it's back. <laughs> and 93 her. also sent us a little thank you with the pair. <laughs> ah, look at that. Once again. More pairs for you, bro. More pairs than Told you. Team pair in here. Fuck oh, damn. <laughs> Are you paranoid? Paranoid. <laughs> Why are you so paranoid? Get some lemons up in you're, there. You're apparently you acknowledging. Are you paranoid? <laughs> um, <laughs> apparently. 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 You're paranoid. <laughs> you're paranoid. <laughs> and apparently acknowledge pairs <laughs> as a pair. This is impairing your <laughs> state of mind. Your judgment. <laughs> My mind is impaired. <laughs> And we got Wasky Wabbit saying, Cramps, visit with the lion and use code BREAL at checkout. Boom. Yeah, there you go. What'd they say about cramps? I don't know. Is it to me? Some CBD <laughs> oh, lion. CBD, <laughs> CBD yeah. lion. Just yeah, use yeah. the code BREAL. You'll get yeah, I should really right go there. to it. You I gotta might. visit the lion. Get some CBD rub. Yeah. No more cramps. I got that <laughs> shit and Tiger Bomb and all that shit. <laughs> and we got Germism in here saying, C minus, great Bismarcky set this morning. Oh, word. R.I.P. Yeah, R.I.P., man. Bismarck Key, man. man. One of the most, like, prolific, I mean, for me in my life, that was one of the, the artists that really kind of made me fall in love with hip-hop as far as DJing, too. Yeah, he had, he had some slappers. Like, in his sound, up. to cut his voice, I mean, yeah. it was the funnest. It just sounded like... To, you know, Pete Rock would fuck it up. I know everyone, we all would. That was like just rhyming with Biz or, uh, yeah. or uh, you know, make the music just to doing doubles on it. Those are just like staples of any DJ coming up. And he provided a lot of, you know, and was a state, was a pillar in this. To this me. is true. Yeah, man. Yeah. He was, oh. he was a nice guy, too. Like, straight up. One mm -hmm. of the nicest guys I met. Yeah, it was, he was... Good, good dude. I remember uh, my BC Boy days. Yeah. When I, uh, he would come up and do Benny and the Jets. I played that. I played that today. And we were just playing behind him and shit. And then, you know, some of the words were there, some of the words were not, but that was the <laughs> best shit about it. <laughs> yeah, dude. You know, he does, the melody was there, and everybody just loved it, man. He, and he was he was a good dude, man. That's a piece for that. No, man. I told him, dude. He no, he was, I remember hearing that song when I was a kid. The Pepsi commercial. Which one? You, yeah. you got what I mean. That was the first oh, yeah, time that, that, that was a blow-up song right there. Hell yeah, yeah. Just a Friend took him to, like, everyone. You throw that record on in any situation, and you still get people singing along to this day. That's right. Especially if they're fucked up. Rest oh, in peace, yeah. Biz. And Germism is asking, be real, any Biz memories that you can share? Uh, not off the top, but just, like, any time that... You know, we were in his presence. He was always just a cool, down-to-earth, funny dude. You know what I'm saying? And, uh, you know, a hip-hop legend. You know, and a student. Mm -hmm. I mean, this dude had all the records, all the breaks, because, you know, he was a dope rapper, okay. but he was also a DJ. Yes. So he had all that crazy shit in his library, and whenever you heard him spin a set, it was... It was legendary. Yeah, dude. He knew, he knew his records. Yeah. Next. 100%. And uh, next we got Mark Lala. He sent us a super sticker. Ooh, what? With the oh. mustache. The no brocha. Brocha. Send the dog's brocha. Mustache. Send dog's mustache on, on Len <laughs> on, on borrow time right now. <laughs> he lend it out for the weekend. The brocha. The brocha. We got another super sticker sent from JB with the trees. Aw. Oh, yeah. Yep. That's right. Yep. Smoke them trees. And we got Welcome to Cali in the super chat saying, I'm a driver in L.A. listening to you guys. Only <laughs> podcast I listen to. And he says, I'm on the 10 West Traffic Co. Right on. Yeah, 10 West sucks. He's right here close. Hell, yeah. Enjoy that traffic, bro. Oh, Enjoy that shit. Thanks for tuning in. Yeah. Hope we're yeah. making it better. Enjoy us in that traffic. Fuck the traffic. Straight up. No, sorry. And we got Cisco2269 saying, Toka, can you give my primo a shout out? He's the only, he's the one that officially put me onto your dope skills back in the day. His name is Gerardo. 
Oh, Gerardo, shout out to you. Thank you. Blessings to you and the family. Thank you. Word. And we have Michael Taylor in here saying, what's up, fam? Been loving Queens of the South. Dope show. Highly recommend checking out Altered Carbon when you get a chance on Netflix. Peace, Mm. all love, no boof. Okay. Right on. Oh, yeah. Okay. And we got uh, Cody Lockhart in here saying, Bolton, keep that Aton in check, dog. Hell yeah. Damn. Damn. He's real. Keep that Aton in check, dude. Damn. God damn it. You hear that? Aton. That was Aton in the chat room right there. He's a like, fuck. <laughs> like he's playing the game. Aton. Thanks for watching my dog during the podcast, Aton. Wow. Oh, wow. Damn, hitting him low. Thanks for watching his dog, dude. Damn, that's low, bro. I'm, I love it. And we got Faya Utenir saying, got some funky tips. They a smoke changer. One love. Thank you. Yep. They are. Salute. Same. Need another one, Bobo? Uh, I'm about to light this one. Oh, I'm okay. That one's man. hiding over there. Yeah. I see it. I got it. <laughs> I know. told him, dude. Oh, yeah. There you go. Because this is not working. Yeah, that, no, that died on us. Yeah. It fought a good fight, though. Yeah. It did. Stop. Fight it. I tried. Stop it, dude. <laughs> I did. All right, next. And we got uh, Alvar Iber in here saying Robert Plant or Freddie Mercury. Uh, it's Robert Plant for me. Robert Plant for me. Uh, Robert Plant uh, for listen, me. Freddie Mercury is dope. Yeah. Like, dope, dope. But Robert Plant for me. And we got Ali89 <coughs> saying some people should hit that like button. I yeah. agree. <sighs> yeah, they're not wrong. Some people. And we got Eddie Flores in the super chat saying happy Monday, y'all. Party one, two, three. And he's yeah. asking, Tony, do you have any Biz Markey stories? Oh, wow, man. Yeah, Biz uh, DJed for, uh, for our Toka Tuesday party. Yeah. I'm not sure if we, we streamed that. I think you did. I think so. Then we streamed that on the uh, on, on the Be Real TV early days. Yeah, early days. Wow, you uh, had legends coming through there. He was one of them. Yeah. So, yeah. Um, but yeah, you know, another time he um, he hit me up. Uh, he was doing an ESPN uh, Latino event, and he was like asking me if I, uh, you know, put some records together for him. You know, different. You know, from merengue joints, couple like. You know, salsa, a couple bachatas, a couple, you know, a little bit of everything. Mm-hmm. So I was like, yeah, so I'm going to put it, I'll put something together. You know, how do you want me to send it to you? He's like, come on, I'm coming to your house, yo, <laughs> like, you know. And, 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 and he cool. actually drove in from, you know, from where he was at. And uh, he popped up, man, and, uh, and we got to kick it in the crib. And, uh, you know, I went through a lot of, like, Latin music with him and, and just kind of, like, gave him some some of the, the the heaters, you know, yeah. in it's each tough. in each like element or genre, you know, just game of, and and but you know for him, him to up. just come through and just make it personal like that was cool, you know. Did he smoke? That's he cool, was man. The, he was he was man. He's gonna be missed. Not that know? I remember. Oh, yeah, yeah. Is, man. God bless him. Yeah, he gave him the arsenal. I gave him, I gave him the heaters. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, he knew his records from. What hey, he I didn't heard. smoke. I don't remember him smoking. No, I, I never know. smoked that well. No, I didn't smoke. Yeah, Listen. I don't think he was yeah. into it. No. All right, next one. And we got Osiris in here <clears throat> saying he got his merch, AAA quality, stay high, and he's saying I told him. Word. There you go. I fucking told him, bro. I was there. Never listened. And we got Jeffro in here saying, Toka, how is making the track Mi Vida Loca by Cypress Hill for the Peacemaker oh. album? Oh, it was amazing. Like Bobo said earlier, it was his first song where everybody participated on it, you know, and, and, and did something on the record. And, man, it was, a, you know, a great moment in time. Beat, I was like 1999 or something like yeah. that. Yeah. I think we recorded that like in 99. So imagine 20, you know, plus years later. Um, um, and, and here we are. But, yeah, man, you know, it was... I mean, it was a banger too, you know. Yeah. Mugs on the beat, shit with some real cypress shit. I think, I think we, we repped that, 
yeah, properly. Definitely. Most definitely. Yeah. Everything with everything we touched was fucking kinda tight. Yes. No, I'm saying I gotta See, say the 50 no MCs, the 50 MCs. We ain't never put one out that wasn't a heater. I don't think. Uh-huh. The 50 MCs. The, oh, the I used to love those. The 50 MCs and the joint you put me on with Nina Scott. Yeah, I think that's my most streamed record. That shit is fire. That one, like you know, out of all like the you know songs I put out there, that's like I think the most streamed. You know, it's, t- it's up there, you know. Yeah. yeah. That's a classic, man. That shit was dope. Yup. Got to hit him with a little reggaeton three soon, I think. Had oh, me out there shit. in Spanish Harlem for the for the video. Yeah. That was that was awesome. Chain. Man, the, just that, that 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 time of the fucking mixtape era, like Ooh. the true mixtape era. Mm. That was that was something I remember every time going to New York when I would go and visit family that Let's go down to the city, get the fucking mixtapes. Oh, you know, yeah. you had them all right there. Oh, yeah. Hell, yeah. And, you know, yours, Clue, you know, you name it. You know, yeah. it was all right there. It was a beautiful you know, time. Amazing. That oh, was a great moment in time. And I tell you, um, we got a documentary coming out. You know, B, put, we did an interview for, I think, uh, you know, right before pandemic. But in any yeah. event, we're done with the film. And, um Look for that to drop soon. We, we talk to everybody. Clue, Kid Capri, you know, um, Ron G. Like, you know, goes all the way back to, uh, you know, it, it's crazy. But um, that's coming soon, you know. Yeah. Uh, mixtape documentary, you know, tell all kind of thing. Yeah, man. And uh, yeah, man. That's what's up, Colton. And we got Michael in here asking, what's everybody's favorite stoner movie? This again. I'm gonna like stoner based. Yeah, I guess. Yeah. It's it's, it's tough. That's a hard one. It's, it's a it's a hard There's one. So many. Pineapple Express. Right Grandma, now. Grandma's boy. Knocked up. Um, I have to say it's a toss up between Up and Smoke and Have Baked for me. Right on. Yeah, Up mm-hmm. and Smoke or um. Or fuck, what's the other one? Yeah, half baked. Half baked yeah. is hilarious. Half baked is amazing. They're they're hilarious. What 100%. about you, Tom? I would probably say one of the Cheech and Chong films. Maybe the uh, Still Smoking or That's a good one. Too. Nice Dreams. Yeah. One of those. I like the other ones, you know. One of those guys. Oh. And Michael's also saying episode three hundred this Friday. Oh, all shit. the best. Damn. Yo, Damn. Shit. Yep. Like that, huh? It's a long time. Damn, on Friday, huh? What's that? Bart's is coming back on Friday, too? Oh. oh! Get the fuck out. Let's, man. I was saying, 300, 300 Damn, episodes. you guys are getting all riled up. Yeah. yeah. Oh, yeah. <laughs> B-Rose making oh, sangria on Friday? Yeah. I think we should have that, oh, Cypress, that Cypress Hill cookout. Oh, no. Oh, no, 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 not if Bart's is coming, though. No. <laughs> no one said Bart's is coming. You oh, I, thought, I thought he said Bart's. I mean, I, I got all hooked. Hey, what about you, that sangria? 300, are, 300 episode edition. Though. That ain't happening neither. <laughs> I mean, you guys yeah, are getting way I mean, for his own show, dude. 300, bro. Get off this episodes, is for Sparta. Dude. Get off me. Next. And the uh, last one right here, we got Mr. Gremlin. He sent us a super stick uh, 100. Uh, 100, thank you very much. 100. 100. Keeping it. Word up. Thank you for all your submissions and your um, super chats and your shout outs and everything else, man. We appreciate y'all. 1,000. All All right. Um, Bobo, got shout outs? Yeah. uh, Catch me on the socials. As always, on Twitter at Eric Bobo, on IG at Eric (laughs) underscore Bobo, on Facebook at Eric Bobo Music. Empiresofficial.com for all the uh, merch and physical copies from the Empire's record from me and Stu Bangers and Cop That. And thank mm-hmm. you all for your support. C minus. Uh, thanks, everyone, for the warm wishes and welcome back. Uh, it was fun. Uh, Got to send a shout out to my mom, my sister, and my nieces and nephews. It was awesome hanging out with you last week. Um, and thanks, everyone, for joining me back on Twitch. Uh, you can follow me over there at C-Fan4. Uh, tomorrow morning, we'll be doing two for Tuesdays. 
And tonight you can catch me on the Motown on Monday LA stream. We'll be doing it live from the shortstop starting at 9 uh, p.m. You can go to uh, my page. I'll be hosting it or go to the Motown on Monday LA. And uh, thank you, everyone. Kitchen Sink Crew, you guys rule. Appreciate you all. Matt Cap 100. Uh, who are Ghost Boogie, everyone we met in Denver. Uh, Papa Bear 303, everyone. Uh, Dusty Journey, like at the High and Hungry thing in Denver. I appreciate meeting you guys. Uh, and thanks for watching uh, here on the podcast and uh, DJCMinus.com. Word. Colton. Uh, thank you guys so much for sending in the submissions. Hope everyone had a great weekend. Shout out to Ray Morning Chef Films and uh, Munchy Monday at Dr. Green Thumbs. So 15% off the edibles. Go check it out. Toca. Yes, man. Shout outs. Love. Thank you, everyone. Peace. Bless. Um, you know, shout out to you guys, of course. And, uh, you know, shout out to everybody tuning in and that supports. And, you know, you can find me at DJ Tony Touch. Um, on uh, all the platforms, I'm still doing the lives, and we still, you know, running around doing what we're doing. We back outside for sure, and here we are. I'm so happy to be in LA and uh, to be able to connect with y'all. You know, after that whole, you know, quarantine situation, yeah, it feels great, man. Thank you. Word up. Word you guys up. got me stoned. <laughs> <laughs> right on. I'll put that out there. Ease on. Uh, yeah, thank man. you to everybody who purchased stuff over the weekend on the website. Go to flavorsbyezone.com or, or highhungry.shop. Uh, look out for a new episode of uh, High and Hungry coming out featuring uh, Arrow Lodge Brewery in uh, the city of Covina. And uh, make sure we got some dope-ass burgers there. There's also going to be new stuff going up on the website. And make sure you check that email. Join the giveaway at Ezone the Firm. Make sure you guys check out the story because there will be a winner picked tonight. Uh, you win some summer slides from uh, the Insane Premium Goods. And, uh, yeah, there, there's a couple comedy gigs I will be posting up on my page as well. Uh, hopefully at the Brea Improv. And I'm sorry, Ontario Improv with Stone and Rob. So. Word up. I want to thank everybody for getting down with us today and on the daily, Monday through Friday, 2 p.m. on the Star Pacific Standard Time. Um, make sure you check out those Dr. Green Thumb locations in Cali with these insane flavor bags. Insane Christmas lights, ice cream cake, Hindu funk, Mac 11, maraschino, ruby red, honeymoon, grape, bonsai, rock star, and the Bermuda, the Cali Knights, the Godfather, popular one, and Mamba Juice. Um, they go quickly, so when you hear they're in the store, you better go get them. All right, make sure you check out the locations, uh, most importantly, the flagship in Los Angeles. All right. Um, you know what? Stay with positivity. Always. Love is the key. No boof, no negativity, no hate. All that shit um, is not the business. All right. So uh, stay with that and uh, smoke that good. Treat yourself right. And uh, we'll be in the mix tomorrow on Twitch. B yep. underscore Real TV. Follow us there. And if you want to, if you want to catch this on the drive. Uh, follow us on Spotify and Apple Music, and you can hear it back and uh, on the replay. Rock that shit with us. True. All right. Um, we'll see you tomorrow. One. Mm.